Simmons, blame me. Simmons, blame me. Simmons, blame me for that spill. Oh, hi. It's me, Sydney Goodman. Hey, she's back. Who? Sydney. At what I consider Chat, to be blame me. my favorite holiday of the season, the 2023 Game Awards. And just like New Year's Sound. Eve, our Game Awards <laughs> opening act is as full <laughs> of excitement and celebration as the big event. Tonight, the Game Awards will celebrate the best in gaming from the past year and okay, we're audio balance. We should be good. Double new game announcements. Here we go. The audio echo. Hold Oscar on. Guard are here from Alan Wake 2. They take the stage for the first time Who ever. Who does a what? It is truly what, what? magical here, live at the Peacock Theater for gaming's biggest night. Is that the Peacock Theater? Connecting millions of gamers. It's where every five, five or so years they have to change the name of that but theater. It's like Law or something. Time to get cozy with our no, very Kia, first Microsoft, Peacock. Very first. Crypto.com. Yes, it comes from a creator well, who has center. already claimed Game of the Year in the past here at TGA, but this time we're going back to the title that started it all a balance, decade ago. Here's the first ever look at a beautiful remake of Brothers, A Tale of Two Sons, originally created by director Joseph Ferris. Joseph Ferris? I don't know what's going on. I do not know what's going on. Uh, this is uh, Fuck the Oscars' first game. Oh, oh, it's him. Oh, it's another two-player cool game? This is his first game. It's, it's like, well, I don't know if it's his first first game, but it's like one of his first games. Yeah. Yeah, Brothers Tale of Two Souls or Tale of Two Tale of Um Tale of Two Dicks. That's, uh, oh, nice. He, yeah, he's been doing co-op games. That's his thing. Well, you know what? I like him. Co-op's awesome. There. That's saying there are large men standing in front of the stage. <laughs> <laughs> there are very, very large men. Large men. Standing in front of the stage. Goons. Hired goons. goons. Hired goons. Hired goons. <laughs> Dude, someone's gonna get up on that stage and you're gonna get fucking drop kicked. You're gonna get thrashed. The problem is, it's almost like a dare now for some idiot. Well, yeah, well, you know, just don't even react to it. They just get drop kicked. Yeah. Look at that hired goon. Look at that goon. Goons! Kojima's gonna try walking up there and he's gonna be like, <laughs> he just tackles him. They have a sniper up there, you know. Depending on how dirty you With like sleep darts. And the nominees are. Disney Illusion Island, Party Animals. The winner Big is Mario Wonder. Wonder. I'm gonna say it Super should be Party Star. Animals. And Super Mario Brothers. But it's Mario Wonder. Wonder. Mario, Mario Wonder. Mario Wonder. One thousand percent. And the game award goes to anonymous. Thank you. Super Mario Brothers. Hey. Oh, wow! wow. Shocks. Take this, Miyamoto or hey, not Bowser. Miyamoto. Don't fucking Bowser. I'm here to accept more awards. Thank you so much for this award. Bowser accepting the award for Mario. Wow, Bowser. Why are they giving out an award a half hour for Mario Award? They did that before. I know. They did that for years. Because there's just too many fucking trailers. That's good for us. That's true. Well, here's the thing. Too many trailers and Oscars do it. To be completely honest, this is the best award show I've ever seen. For me, to be real. Because they 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 stuck E3 in an award show. So they just like mass They made it interesting. They made it interesting. They made it interesting. Yeah, what if the what if the Oscars showed some sick movie trailers? Movie trailers for next year. Why don't they? Why the fuck? Yeah, right. So again, I actually Why don't they? I gotta give Jeff credit. This game goes to everyone that created such a wonderful experience. You can't hear him. He had nothing to do with the game. You don't need to hear what he has to say. It's a plan for me, A. Damn. Congratulations, Super Mario Brothers Wonder. Yeah, but and imagine now, like a trailer you, for a movie you didn't even know, or the first trailer for uh, Avengers, what? you know? Mm -hmm. First up is the next game from Daniel Mullen, the thank creator you. of the TGA nominated independent game, Inscription. Water looks great. Water singing. Water looks better than GTA water. You can only say that because Steve's not here. Exactly. It's a USB stick. <sighs> A straight up a USB stick. That's normal. This is a, <laughs> this is a VR game. <laughs> That's normal. <laughs> this is a VR game. Oh, speaking of which, Resident Evil VR came out. Oh. Yeah. We have play. We're playing it this weekend, boys. Now it looks like that Saturn game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> and now it's Dark Seed. Yeah. Now it's Oregon Trail. That's that's a lot of things. 
gonna play this. This has definitely some big Undertale inspiration. Oh, heck yeah. If not potentially made by the Undertale people. Just wait a second. Hey, that guy. That pro -ZD? Yeah. I call him Prod Z. I call him Prod Z. Yeah, he <laughs> called him that by I accident I at, at Universal. I saw him there. Okay, this is 100% Undertale dev. Wow. Okay, so this has to be somewhat in v like VR? No. Nah. Well, you can definitely say it's unique. Pony Island 2! And a circus! Let's fucking go! 25, 20. Like, did you see that? It was flickering between 5 and 6. No, we'll figure it out. Yeah. Yeah. We'll figure it out. Oh, a Netflix game. I have Solitaire from Netflix. We'll be constantly panicking with the audio all night, chat. We'll find a perfect right. balance. Yeah, that was a 300 gift sub bet. The audio? No. Oh, Pony Island 2 <laughs> Park <laughs> Circus <laughs> Illusion? <laughs> the audio. The audio is a gift sub bet. <laughs> yeah, the audio. Max is going to fuck with the audio for 30 minutes. No, how many times? Like, if, you, if it's like. You know, like seven times? That's how, just... how many times will Max fuck with the audio? Yeah. No chronic, thank you. That was a thing. No bulges here. I think a lot of these games are gonna there's the indie showcase that I think that's going on tomorrow. Indie showcase is going on right now. Oh dear. What's tomorrow? That's bad for them. I don't know. We'll watch it. Yeah, no. Oh, Tomorrow is where you get to play all the games. <laughs> Yo, Gildo, thank you. Eh? Oh, sweet baby. Sweet mm. baby. Sweet, sweet baby. <laughs> Animal Crossing speed. Yeah. I don't know a lot about that now. Oh, wow. That was an action game. Yeah, nice. Alex, thank you. Ooh, okay. Got that indie vibe, but with some cool action. Well, it looks fun. It know? looks pretty good. It looks like fun to actually engage with enemies. Yes. You got a key blade. You got like the best of both worlds. Like, it's some indie stuff with some. It's definitely Spider Verse inspired. Oh, for sure. Synchronous, thank you. Usual June. If this doesn't come out in June, there's a problem. 25! Did you hear about Garfield? In the, new, in the new Nick Jones game? You, can, you can't play him on Monday. can't play him on Mondays. Oh, he's I not available. That. If it's Monday, he's not on the character roster. That's amazing. That's, and, and that's such a great dedication. Media, TikTok Live Fest is happening now across 50 plus countries on TikTok. Check out the participating gaming creators. If you're a Garfield man, you literally need a backup. All of your favorite gaming you're going to a tournament on, on Monday. With hashtag I think no tournaments are ever on Monday. Okay, <laughs> we're going this to is take true. a quick break, but there is plenty more opening act after a very important message. If Gar TikTok! If Garfield is like OP, then you just like have your Which tournaments on Mondays. <laughs> <laughs> yep. A place of wonder and awe. Grand Turismo. We breached the cosmic veil and reached a new planet. Yet generations later, this world remains oh, yeah, untamed. Looks just like Nier, bro. Yeah. It's not here. Look, it's the exact same thing. It's, it's it just is. Our paths destined to cross. It's, it's, it's identical. I'm here for you. It's literally for you. I it's not near. It's literally for you. I, I see no difference. Yeah. Not near. I actually see zero difference. It looks the exact same. I see anime The difference, and the bucks. difference you plebs, <laughs> is that if this was a near game, like a guitar game, these, these characters would all die some hideous, painful death. Oh, that would be the result of your player actions. Code Bane? There's no saving waifus in Tara's game. They just die had, miserably. If you had a guy who only plays Grand Theft Auto, he'd probably say it's the same game. Ooh. Okay. Whoa, like human Okami?
I'm guessing human Okami would just be Ghost of Tsushima. Would. Yeah. Would. It would. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Jesus, too intimidating. I'm what? intimidated. Yeah, I'm intimidated. I'm intimidated. I'm intimidated. This, this menu is scaring me. Yeah. Is that the name of it? <laughs> yes. Chosen One! It is the name of it. No, I'm I think it's the coming. Master's Kung Fu. The has fallen. C2, thank you. Now Chosen I'm One! Mental to restore the dynasty to its former glory. <laughs> to reclaim what humanity has game? lost. I think so. It looks very League-ish, right? No, it's uh, Warhammer. 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 Warhammer of Legends. League of Legends and Warhammer are the same thing, right? Yeah. Warhammer. Well, Jim Caviezel is going to come out and... Sponsor it. Jim who? Oh, Henry Cavill. Oh, whatever. Jim Caviezel. <laughs> Big difference. Who the fuck is Jim Caviezel? <laughs> Big difference there, buddy. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Big difference there. I don't yeah. even know who that is. Yeah. Henry Cavill needs to come out with these. I'm actually not. Jim Caviezel, I'm Henry Cavill. No, no. Same, they're the same person. <laughs> they're just, it's like a Superman thing. They just decorate. Yeah. <laughs> <That's, that's, that's, laughs> oh no. We're probably saying something terrible. <laughs> who is. Oh, he's going Jesus. <laughs> he played Jesus, and he stars in a lot of like. Okay, like, <laughs> is this some horrible person? No. Time to see if I'm gonna get canceled. Man, VR. Today, you are to see a traitor. Now this is VR. Assassination. I wonder what it would be like in the VR, because like I don't like dead. heights. So playing yeah. this. But didn't you play Call of the Mountain? Oh, so did you just watch us play it? We, 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 we all put our head in it. Yeah, I played this shit. I played it on my stream and I was literally almost falling. You're fine. Here's this pepper shaker. Oh, what could be better? Yeah, I was literally almost falling down. Like, in the end, the temple. They do need a VR game where you have to like serve people their food, and, like you know, pepper grinder. Yeah, <laughs> cheese grater. You know, yeah. like you know. Did you buy more parmesan? Yeah. Is this like the first game? Like, I don't want to be a snob no. or anything here, but these, these, this is some. Um, some old looking graphics. Yeah, it looks like a PS3 game. Yeah. It obviously. I wonder if it's only. Ah, uh, so there you go. It doesn't have like next gen tech in it. That's why. Oh, it's not yeah. Welcome back to the 2023 Game PS... Awards opening act. Yeah, I'm too. Come on, bro. Goodman. Here with another Although that one's supposed to be pretty powerful. That one's expensive. That one's more expensive than PSVR 2. The is massive, but honestly, it should be even bigger. And no chance of Pragmata, no chance. Gaming beyond its current limits. Their teams have created software VR and hardware that make it possible for people uh, of Resident all abilities VR. to experience the medium of gaming. Thank you, thank you. accessible for features and technology that get us all, all one mountain. step closer to a seamless play for everyone. Jesus Christ, These man. I don't like heights. Work. And call and the mountain, are. I was almost fucking Diablo falling War. down. Forza Motorsport. Accessible. This is probably this is tough. Diablo. This is probably going to Spider-Man 2, but you're no, right. Diablo. 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 I'm going to say either Spider-Man 2 or Street Fighter 6. Street Fighter 6 has some crazy Diablo accessibility. I'm Spider-Man 2 on this. Mortal Kombat 1 also. The they had um, a team of I'm going to Spider-Man. Forza Motorsport. Oh, no, no. That's right. I, I That's know. right. You know what? I, I completely blanked know. on this because yeah. I think okay. I even said this in my prediction video. I'm like, no, no, no. Forza did like some crazy so thing. I remember a video going up yeah. at some point somewhere, and like they did some insane stuff for Forza, yeah. like for the most recent one. I'm not even upset that you know Street Fighter didn't win because obviously, right? Like giving people that don't normally have the chance to play at games like the accessibility to play games is fucking amazing. Yeah. So any of these winning is like cool. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Yeah, because MK had some really cool stuff. I don't think like they had their they had. Uh, some some fighting game accessibility has come a long way. Yeah. It's like yeah. MK and there's a really uh, good blind Street Fighter. There's a good blind mode for MK. Yeah, KI literally has like a, a blind player that competitively plays KI. Yeah, yeah. it's cool. It's insane. For accessibility Any, and making this game what? the best that it can be. Big thank you to the UI team. No, I remember there was some crazy. Yeah. They did do a crazy amount of stuff for and accessibility. Last week, and Cole for we don't play it, so we're a little like accessibility consultant partner for the last two years. Some insanity really thing of the work for, that we've been able to do. So thank you very much. Um, mm. This actually doesn't surprise me. I, like now when they said it, I was like, oh yeah, that's a, that was a big thing. Congratulations, Forza Motorsport. 
Here at the Game Awards, we believe strongly in accessibility and want to celebrate any game that makes it a priority. And our next developer, The Odd Gentleman, believe that by making their games and their company accessible and, and really inclusive, good at it too, but, they can develop you know, they new types year. of They have a lot of stuff as well. With stories that everyone uses. I mean, it's funny, everybody it. uses they these. Everyone the uses these. In a deep the, collaboration the, yeah, with artists and developers oh, yeah. in the deaf community. And we are <laughs> Frankly, very the 3D excited audio to reveal and Fortnite, it now. Not good. <laughs> this is a Harmonium Meal, thank Musical. The Odd Gentleman. Oh, nice. Dude, I uh, mm. ran into, I uh, in, in my chat, this. the person that did the animation for the hand gestures of all the sign in Spider-Man 2. Really? Was in my chat. I remember sitting there thinking, like, Whoa. oh my god, like, I was super impressed, but also, like, this that, is that, I said the same thing. That must have sucked so this much. This is so much work, Because that's so Ooh. much work to do. Because everyone knows, any any artist or animator knows <laughs> hands are hard. Hard as oh shit. Oh my god. And have to like animate all the fingers and the hands is a nightmare. Hands are tough. And having to do ASL like This is awesome. As soon as we as soon as I saw that, I was like, that looks insanely tough. And somebody in the chat was like, it was. It was my job. <laughs> and I was like, really? You know, like as I worked forever on I did this specifically. Like I was like, the hand they animator. They must have spent every minute that game was in development. <laughs> Pretty <laughs> much, right? Yeah. That was their job. One person did that. Yeah, I think Kelly and Kira would love this because they both did ASL and they're really big on ASL. AS, I did ASL as well. Yeah. And they love they love sign. So. Yeah, and it's I mean the same thing happened to Ripley, Ripley where yeah. she learned ASL first. Before yeah. speaking, the hu human humans because humans learn it faster. Humans' brains will learn ASL faster than they will learn speech. Mm. So, and it's funny. Ripley defaults back to it sometimes when we're like, "No, Ripley, you can't have." Then she'll do this, yeah. and she'll wow. eventually, after it's actually, she tries everything to communicate. I want that. Give me the candy. She'll so start doing like gift. Yet, <laughs> what happens past a golden age? Platinum? Is this the platinum age of gaming? Also, can I please be paid in platinum? I'd like a direct deposit. And I get a platinum games and announcement. And now I have the honor of announcing the winners for That's our five esports categories. That's scary now because everybody's category. gone. Everybody's gone. The nominees for best <laughs> That is scary. Everybody's gone. There's a couple good people. Let's out. go! Demon Wars. Imperial Hearts! And Imperial Hearts. Faker's gonna win. And the game award goes Faker to... Faker will win. what I tell Faker. you, Faker! He fakes everyone out with his moves. He will go like, I'm gonna go right and he goes left. Baker's the best. Well, this one. Potter, Zonic, Gunba. Uh, this one, Kenny. Gunba. Gunba. Oh, I was giving him Gunba. He's like, Gunba, Gunba. Oh, shit. Don't make it. Shit. You stupid bitch. Shit. For best esports event, here are the nominees. Evo. 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 Everything else will be disqualified. Evo. Shut up, Simmons. Nobody likes Valorant. Championships 2023. I'm and being a Valorant Champions 2020. <laughs> You're taking up on Steve's slack. I'm taking up on Steve's slack. Oh, shit! Oh, oh, shit! Oh, shit! Boom! Oh, Fox! The they, did they have a stadium? The fuck are these Do they games have games? a fucking these stadium? Games? I don't even know what these games are! What? And the fuck are these games? Valorant. The Game Award goes to... Valorant. 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 Yeah! Yeah! Evil Geniuses. Are they gone? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Evil Geniuses is gone now. Really? I think they are. Not Chad, yeah, didn't they like disband? JD Gaming. Oh. Uh, yeah, is it Rip EG? They're gone. As a huge esports fan, just Burn like to the ground. Anyway, I mean, would have been, nice, been a nice send-off. Send oh, it was like when Nibel left the Content Creator of the Year. But yeah, last year, and he was, and he was like, I'm done. It was right after he left the internet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. First up is the latest game from a team that won at the Game Awards back in 2017. So I think we can trust them to crush it again. Studio Fortnite. MDHR. What? Fortnite. This is Studio MDHR. This? Uh, no. Nah, no. This ain't no Studio MDHR. This is no. made on a computer, bro. And, 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 and. Raw Hollow? It has Brawlhalla. Brawlhalla vibes. Jeez. <laughs> With Mortal Kombat? Dead Cells. Dead Cells. Okay. Jericho, thank you. Furry Cells. Dead Furry. This is a very charming trailer. Oh. 
three. Was Dead Cells multiplayer? No. I think there was a mod or a mode that Maybe. Dead played. Cells was a... Uh, or something? Uh, this is a very visually nice Metroid game. Metroidvania. Yeah. It's with three-player roguelites, right? Like, even Aliens Fireteam was like... Why not four? Why not four? Why not four? I do appreciate the four. It is striking, right? That's like what they're... Yeah. That, that's their shock factor. Damn. This is an This is actually a really good trailer. You killed my friends! Dang. Where's my hermit? Wind blowing. Why is it mind blowing? Mind blowing. <laughs> I was like, I want to play mind blowing. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, some weird shit. Hell yeah. Some VR weird shit. Let's Ooh. go. Yep. Nice. So this is, this is trippy flower. Oh. Lucy in the sky with diamonds. It's pretty much, yeah, a, a, a Beatles song, but with like crazy dark fantasy, yeah. you know, cover mm -hmm. of an 80s album shit. Yeah, 80s, yes, yeah, it's an 80s album. Yeah. LSD. Whoa. Oh, it's the other one, the Joe Rogan drug. Thrasher. Thumper. Cool. Thumper Thrasher. It looks like the sequel to Thumper. Thumper was really cool, man. Yeah. That game's a fucking vibe. DMT, yes. yeah, DMT Thrasher, simulator. In case you didn't know, is Jamie, from thank the you. same artist slash composer that blew our minds back in 2016 with the cult hit Thumper. Mm. I'm so excited we've got another mind-bending game coming from him in 2024. Special shout out to Samsung and Samsung Gaming Hub, who, not to brag, are also throwing a massive Game Awards viewing party. Over yeah, this set Samsung's looks good this year. You did a good job. Location, Especially that big guy right there. Especially the large man. The large man sitting right up there. The and there's I another large man myself, right there. There's a fence. There's actually a little fence between them. Yeah. Oops. But we can talk about that later. Let's check out what Samsung is coming out with now. Game Pass is real. They might ask, like, hey, how many people are you bringing up if you win or something like uh, that? If there's anything KI in here... No, never mind. That's not... But it's about to get added. This is on the TV. 30 gifts of bet if there is uh, anything KI in here. No console? Yeah, this your TV is a console now. Yeah, it is. This is the same year, uh, what's it called? The cloud streaming thing? Yeah. I mean, that's kinda, Sunbreak, really. I think it's kind of cool, like, like if, you know, you're an old, you know, like... Person in the, you know, like you just want to try it. No, not like open, like your grandson's coming by, right? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, my TV has video games on it. This is you know, how many, how many times you've oh, been to like a relative's house and there's no console, no nothing. Good morning. Let's begin. Sewing is my life. Last one. You know what's Go funny? I used to make fun of like sewing, and now, now it's such a cool thing, especially about. if you're a cosplayer. Mm -hmm. Like, man, I wish I took going. It's actually a very good skill Yes, a hundred percent. This is the this is the Persona 100%. game that Giant Bomb played. No, this one's not. Uh, this is a remake. Of the That's what I mean. Like Giant Bomb back in the day had their like legendary Persona playthrough. If I Someone's oh, hard as fuck, but have it's no idea. super cool. I don't know what you're. Saying. Chad, is that is that Maybe? it? Maybe I have no idea. That was Persona that. Four. Okay, that was Four. I don't know anything about a Giant Bomb. A time period hidden between but one day. But it was literally from like 15 years ago. This is a remake of. PS2, and attack anyone PS2. who roams free outside. I think it's the PS2 one. It's like it's not it's not including if we're, the updated stuff. Nice. If we're talking about the history of Let's Plays, it was honestly one of like the first big Let's Plays ever. Oh. This is the one where they shoot themselves in the head, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. This is the shoot yourself in the head. Though. Which they are not showing. Because of shooting yourself in the head, bro. In fact, I don't even really have a good reason to live. You think they would take that imagery away? Uh, they I don't think it would be as prominent. Yeah, it, it wouldn't be prominent. Yeah, and yeah, it was all over the place in the ads before. Like it was in the the, the magazine ads. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was, a, like, was a different. It was a different time. Oh, look at this. Yeah, it was a different time. To me, it'll be in the game. I would yeah. assume it just won't be like cover the box will be a guy looking to blow his brains out. Yeah, or, or in the trailer. Other trailer. Okay. 
it's a nice time to just drop everything. I just, you know, it's fine. I just remember hearing about it. Like, yo, you just shoot yourself in the head. Play like, Persona what? today on Xbox. On Xbox, Persona on and X, Persona X, Xbox. Yes, I was hoping for a new Persona, a new Persona game that is. I still want to be Sydney. Hmm. But enough about me. Make sure to stay tuned as Google and the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5 are bringing you a spectacular celebration of mobile gaming. It's going to be an epic event, just joke. like this next one. The joke that happened a couple seconds ago. It's the product ago. of a Did surprise no team up That's between two nominated games tonight. Let's check it out. Yeah. Oh, this. Oh, this is. Yeah, this, uh, I was like, is this Dredge? This is uh, the most unique game that I've ever Super garage style game. game. Made by Dark Sun. Made by people in their basement with the money they scrapped together from part time jobs or whatever. Next song. <laughs> this dredge was Dave the Diver Dredge. Yeah. Dredge the Diver. I can't believe it. It's almost time for our big show. The theater is filling up behind me. It's hard to I hear myself something. think over all the excitement, what but happened? I have to keep it together because Who's gonna I win have the best award ready to go. Restreamer of Here the Game are your Awards. for content creator of Oh no. Iron Mouse. Quackity. No Iron Mouse. Quackity. Quackity follows me on Twitter. I'm so old. Quackity. I'm like I'm so old. And the Game Award goes to Out of touch. Iron Mouse! Hey, 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 Iron Mouse! Iron Mouse! Iron Mouse! Iron Mouse! Iron Mouse! Sort of. By association. Uh, six yeah. degrees but of separation. I put in a good word. Take it away, Iron Mouse. I am so incredibly honored. That's Iron Mouse? Yes. Wow. Creator of the Year Award. First and foremost, I. At one point, Iron Mouse had the most subs on Twitch. Heartfelt gratitude. To the community <laughs> that has gathered around I'm out, I'm out with fighting game stuff. I also want to extend what? a very special thanks to Vishojo, who brings all If you don't know what a VTuber is, let me introduce you, Seven. Let me introduce you to VTuber. Next to Iron Mouse, huh? Game yes. Game <laughs> sorry. Not a per I haven't, like, gone and hung out with them, but, you know. Have you seen Max and Iron, Iron Mouse at the same place at the same time? Okay, we're getting so close no. to the big show, <laughs> yeah. but I'm not ready to let go just yet. And no, I'm not a narcissist. I'm just a hoarder, a hoarder of world. Listen, premieres. thank you. And up next is a very special world premiere, 15 years in the making. World of goo! Seriously? What a beautiful world. Is that a Switch remote? It totally is. Too bad they never made another one. <laughs> Have you I like the premise of this trailer. World of goo. Feels like God is kissing me. <laughs> oh shit. Remember that whole Mega 64 song? Yeah. Tootie Boy. How are you gonna modernize World of Goo? How do you do that? Use color. No. These are these games, like, right at the same time where things like Where's My Water and, you know, yeah. Angry Birds were popular. Remember Angry Birds? Whoa. Sega bought that. Sega bought that shit not even that long ago. What's the one that survived the longest of all of these? Pretty much Candy Crush, Candy right? Crush. Candy Crush is the one that that Whatever that game your mom will play will win. Dude, my, my mom plays... Chat, how many of your mothers, mothers play that Scrabble game on their phone? Words with friends. Oh. Yeah, words with friends. Jesus, oh dude. I had to delete from my mom's phone 90 gigs. Some crazy amount of words with friends data so that her phone would work again. Creators of Persona 3, 4, and 5. My man, I'm giving that. us a glimpse into the story, characters, and gameplay. Let's do this. All right, here we go. It's a story 
about a world very different from ours. Oh, this is that one weird persona game. Like, not persona, right? Yeah, Shin, Shin, Shin Megami. Fantezo metaphor. To put it another way, this is a fantasy. Metaphor! It's also Dune! But it is the final fantasy. Or the first. The fool of a king is dead! Without an heir to this is the crown. game that is standing in the way. Of the, royal oh, magic. Sorry, sorry. the fortress of the border was raised by a human mere days ago. Wait, it's real time? Yeah. Ah! Well, I'm with it. Wait. Oh. A man of proven strength. Some parts are? People of my land desire a new king. And I shall provide. Welcome one and all to the inauguration of the tournament for the throne. Small wonder when any among the populace might be king. Their speeches of tribal harmony mean nothing. When every day they no. see no. and abuse us. I mean, the way it's Kenny, running. Kenny, you're going to get fucked up for that. Oh, God. It's running. I'm going to miss Kenny. It's 30 frames, bro. I was really looking forward to playing games with Kenny this weekend, but I'm going to miss him. I decided that that. <laughs> yeah, it is very low res. I, 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 yes! I mean, obviously. Is it on Switch? Probably. No. Is it on Wii? No, no. Wii U. Series S and X. Oh dear. Why is it running like that? Don't get mad at me. Get mad at them. <laughs> Jesus oh, Christ. Please. Kitty's like, please get mad at them. Yeah. Okay, my friends, that is it for our opening act, but we are very far from done. Our big show is about to begin, but don't worry, this isn't the last you'll see of me. I'm staying on. Wow, so no FF Reaper trailer beforehand. That's happened before. There's a remake trailer in the pre show. Yo, nothing square. Even more don't get mad at me. Brand new games like, what was the biggest thing they showed pre show? Yeah, actor, pretty much that. Yeah, I guess so. For some stuff. The Muppet himself, the great Gonzo. I have to admit, I'm freaking out. I'm completely starstruck. And get this, the cast of the show, based on the Fallout franchise, is here to debut an exclusive new look at the series. The vault is opening in a huge way tonight. Shut up, Look at him. In the Thank corner. It looks, it looks like, like Frankie Frankie Moon is right there. I mean, a host could ask for. Kid. Let's do the boss level. The 2023 Game Awards starts now. Kenny. It looks like him. Kenny, please. Isn't he like way older The now? kid right he's there. He's much older than that. Frankie's he's a ball. Frankie Muniz is like, old now? He's like 60, dude. What the hell? Now, now, your Jesus host, Christ, that's hard to do. Game Awards. Jeff yeah, look at all the big yeah, guys. Those guys, guys are big, dude. <laughs> and they're, holy shit. They all, like, assume the pose. Look at those guys. Yeah, look, I think they actually stopped somebody already. Yeah. This guy's in metal armor, bro. <laughs> metal armor? How did he get to the metal detector? And Numa was sitting behind God. Uh, How did that guy get to the metal detector, bro? <laughs> you know they had metal detectors. Like, beep. Tonight is our 10th TGA. <laughs> A global He's in fucking night armor. He's expecting boy, to win, bro. We have a show for you. I am so excited to get this started. Together, we are going to recognize outstanding creative work in games in 2023, and we'll look into the future with an astonishing lineup of world premieres. More than anything, this is a yes, show Kojima that for his PMC military. Yeah. In this room and online around the world. <laughs> it's Kojima Most PMC. It's all like the sound There's or nothing more powerful or more immersive than an extraordinary goons. video game. Hired goons. Look at those guys, dude. Look at how great games comfort us, help us understand different perspectives on the world, and even change us. That's what makes this medium different. Games. The actual things we play are insanely special, and we're going to celebrate that for the next few hours. And we've got such an amazing group of people with good, us. Good They're good built training. by talented creators and teams, and many of them are here tonight. Mr. Anuma, Mr. Fujibayashi, great to see you back after winning Game of the That's Year. That's us. In is, that, is, is that yes. my name? That is my name. Hello. Guy has freaking armor. Hello. He did that to win. Hi, hey. Hey, hey. Why is it that hard? Yes. I'm here. I didn't think you wanted me to bring food up here. I'm here. What's going on? Hey, hey, hey. 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 Hey, that's true. Everyone's here. You and Steve. Yeah. Hands, our Steve's best here. It's like a shot of you here. Yeah, he was waiting. He was waiting on me. Welcome. I think we'll be seeing oh, that's you right. a little Hellblade. bit later tonight. 
Is that the Hellblade? That's the Hellblade and chair. We are also honored to be joined by the <laughs> It's been so long. Send to us her name, I think. Oh, like, is that, is that Hellblade? Of from oh, this year. that's and the, the Capcom. Uh, that's, that is, that's, uh, that's the wine guy. Uh, that's that's, Mr. Mr. that's Mr. Mr. fucking Capcom right yeah. there. Big and his son. Show. So let's get right Monster into Hunter, it. Bro. To present tonight's first uh, award is last year's winner of best performance. Please join me. And welcoming back John to the Capcom. Yep, now, will his, the will his, uh, will his Kratos, entrance speech be shorter than his acceptance speech? Christopher mm. Judge! He, and will he mention it? Oh, he will. 100%. He has to say something hey. about it. He must say something about it. Oh, oh, he already oh, did. Oh. He already did. He looked at his watch. Oh, yeah, 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 I enough. told you. That means it's time. I told you. <laughs> What's the first award for? Uh, Performance? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get some pizza. This man's hair is flawless. I gotta warm it up. Good evening, everybody. What? When did you buy it? Like, oh, he's here. It's gonna be a long while on the mic. Oh, that was long. Such a pleasure to be back here. I have such great memories of last year, Mr. Pacino. Forgetting to thank my wife. <laughs> They're playing the music already. <laughs> <laughs> he looked around. <laughs> Hell yeah. Mother. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. All right, all right. I get it. I get it. <laughs> Hey, gonna, Final uh, Fantasy guy. Yep. Stand up here, making long speeches. I'm gonna stick to the script. No eight minute speech like last I'm gonna year. Stick to this man's What's hair. God that? damn. I need that. My speech was actually longer than this year's Call of Duty campaign. Oh, <laughs> got him. Got him. God damn. Sick burn, bro. Oh, damn. Sick burn. Get wrecked. Uh, another company I'll never work for. Uh, another uh, company I'll never work for. Award. <laughs> hey, hey, Microsoft throws them now. Performance. In a year of games, beloved by audiences and acclaimed by critics. Man, I could have got some pizza, bro. He's taking a while. Delivered six. Bro, oh, everyone's looking at each other weird. <laughs> what the heck? What's happening? He said, he said my speech was longer than this year's Call of Duty campaign. And then he's like, there's a, like, there's a company I'll never work for. Ooh, man, stop. Fuck. Damn, Damn, bro. Who's winning? Uh, ben should win. I think she's gonna win. That is my prediction. Have you played the game yet? Oh, Neil's the winning. Yo, get the hell out of here. I heard he was really good. Oh, he's winning. Everyone went horny. Yuri Lowenthal has Neil. smoke in Mortal Kombat 1. Going to Alan Wake. Neil. Whoever wins, Jeff has given me the okay to say, take as long as you want to, thank everyone who's ever meant anything in your life. <laughs> And I he just did. Alba. He's like, I'm Double somewhere. Yeah, I'm not, like not here. He just Alba. Man, don't have time for this shit, right? Man, out here making real and movies. The award goes to Neil. Suck it! Yeah. yeah, I told you. And I heard he did. I heard he, he did. Really fucking did. Dude, every, the entire internet got horny for him. It begins, bro. Baldur's Gate. The run of Baldur's Gate. Gate. The run of Baldur's Gate. Easy, early. Just as to tell you the story, Chad. Baldur's Gate should be taking a ton of shit here. End game of the year. But I still think it's going to be the tried and true. Zelda's going to win it. You know, just... I, I think that's what's going to happen, but VG3 should be taking a lot of shit. That looks like he's from, like, <clears throat> Cyberpunk. So is it like an Elder Ring type of game? Mm, no. Like, Very RPG. Uh, oh. it's, a, it's a d and simulator. Ah, yeah. Um, I remember that. This is unreal. Um, I just wanted to say, I know I don't have much time. Um, <laughs> I'm saying. <laughs> ah. Well, I'll give it a shot. Uh, so, no, thank you so the very, entire very world much for everyone voted. Thank my incredible... Uh, so that is wearing. Yeah. Yeah. That guy's in a suit of armor. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I've said that even six and a half minutes ago. Is, is extraordinary, so thank you very much. Right? Right? No, no, ever since I shut up. I said, writers, how did he get through the metal detectors of the show? Uh, to, I'm going to forget everybody. Uh, to uh, Pitstop, who worked so hard, the directors, my fellow actors, 248 oh, no. incredible metal, actors that gave heart and soul. How deep is the security uh, right now? Oh, the, there's <laughs> goons. Several large men. Yeah, several, several large men, men. In, in, a, in a row. <laughs> and to my agents, I will thank you later. I'm sorry. I'm going to wrap looks, it up apparently. Well, I have the shoes. One thing I will say, please, that's um, okay. But he the looks like. Um, has reached out to so many of us at Larian and said they were seen. 
And they were represented by this game when they lost hope, they felt isolated, they felt alone, and this game brought them together and gave them something to push through. Man, that looks like metal, bro. And to oh, you, I want to say thank you so much for seeing us. I appreciate it. Man. Really? They start playing the music? There we go. <laughs> I have <laughs> those same exact <laughs> <laughs> is, that how, is that how they get them off now? That's how they've always gotten them off. Yeah. <laughs> so they just didn't for Chris last year. Right. They just, <laughs> just kept going. Yeah, rock, yeah. Jeff was like giving away Steam decks by the minute. <laughs> yeah. Now that's 100 now, it's limited. It's short, so thank you. Uh, there are lots wow. more awards to come, but now it's time to look ahead to what you'll be playing next. Let's get to those world premieres. And for the honor of presenting our first one, oh my it's God. an incredible thrill to introduce a true Renaissance man. Please welcome Academy Award winning actor and New York Times best selling author, Matthew McConaughey. There's our celebrity. There's our. Let's go! There's our confused celebrity. He's looking at him. He's so confused. He's, not, he's wearing a. God damn, he's wearing a t shirt. And he just woke up. Thank you all for having me. <laughs> oh, man, I want my Keanu. Good to be here. What's up, everybody? Hey, what's up, Good to gamers? be here with you at the Game Award. <laughs> no, Is he wearing a death row chain? I'll tell you what. <laughs> I was going to say the line that has preceded me on my career. All right, all right, all right. But they there, told see? me. Right, they said, they're no, waiting no, for no. it. Don't do that. Come out and say, pew, you know pew, pew. Yeah. What the fuck is happening right now, dude? All right, we'll see how that, how that, how that ends. <laughs> right. I'm here tonight because I have a death row, bro. premiere for you from Austin's own Archetype Entertainment. Right? I think it is. I swear, Chad, am I crazy? It was Shadows covering it. Right? It was originally a rapper. I'm guessing. But I'm a part you of it. You might have some stock in it. Might be. <laughs> when the Archetype team first reached out to me, I was excited about becoming a part of the gaming world. But what really it turned is death me row. on was when they what? shared the game's vision and my role in it. <laughs> okay. I will be voicing a character in this game. And all I can say is that I will have a unique relationship with every player. In this game, Time moves differently. Oh. Days for you are decades for your loved ones back home. That the one movie that you make yeah. <laughs> not only affect the people that you love, they'll also affect your entire civilization for generations to come. Interstellar. The Age of Empires. I have had some experience with time dilation. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah. And now you can too. Woo. Yeah. <laughs> so now I am proud to I share the first ever look Supreme. at. My Chrysler. Exodus. Exodus. Space game. Did they hire him just because he was in the Yes, yes. Yeah. I mean, absolutely. Hold on, I'm getting a reading. Pretty much known for that movie, isn't he? Oh, oh is this going to be like a, a, a super high budget, like No Man's Sky? That'd be nice. I mean, it already is a super high budget. That day was a miracle. It would be our salvation to fight oh. against the Celestials. Oh, that's humanity's getting... greatest. Oh, sick, Dooney. My dreams. This is it. Yes. Right? Yeah, right? Magnified. Stay down. Okay. All right. All right. The Celestials. Destiny Three. They keep chasing us until they ripped our ship apart. Okay. And I had to save her. I led them away from this world. Away from her. At least they had gone in there with you. Right? right? Like, I mean, yeah. there was enough space. There was like seven seats. Right? Like, yeah. uh, he's gonna, like, yeah, he's gotta take the ship up elsewhere and lead him away. Speed, time slows to a crawl. It was only days for me, but an entire lifetime hey, Josh passed for her. And in the chaos of those final moments, we never said goodbye. No, come with me! Wait! Please! Tom! It wasn't real space. I love you. Our service. Our sacrifice. This is just Titan AE2. Ooh, Seed. like... I'll watch that. Breaks is this just a C2?
four. Brute force. And crocodiles. That was music it brute force though. Four players. It was. Whatever. Shut up. That kid. is a very exciting Damn, project. Music. Give me some Mass Effect vibes, and I appreciate the team sharing the first glimpse of gameplay uh, at the end. There looks great. Jeff All right. Well, now we're gonna go that. right on. <laughs> you have to he, he appreciates them for re yeah. releasing the trailer, but not uh, Rockstar. Or he hates them. They don't need them. What? PlayStation. But he needs them. That's Granny too. That's really good. No. God of War DLC. Yeah. Calling it. Music. No, it's the music. One game you like. The music. Uh, Returnal. Oh, yeah. shit. Yeah, of course nice. it's Returnal, yeah. First, uh, first, uh, the no, music, dude. Yeah, the yeah, music, music killed it, gave it away. I think I had this on my TV. That's what? pretty crazy they would announce it here. You know, they've done that before, but I thought they would save this for our PlayStation Just Showcase. What's no deal something about World War One? Why exactly are we doing this? You need it. Yeah, but this does leave Kratos like in an in between. Yes, exactly. Like you knew, like he was. This going is definitely going to bridge us to where the hell his story's going to go after exactly, this. Exactly, exactly. I'm guessing there won't be any um uh, any boy in this one. No, I mean he's he's alone in all these right now, right? Yeah, pretty much. That's right. Yeah, what's her name? Oh, chat's saying it's a roguelike. It, it, it looks that way because he's finding like a bunch of enemies in small areas. <laughs> Valhalla, oh, Ragnarok. Valhalla would make sense. That makes sense because yeah. you're like ascending, right? Yeah. That's cool. <laughs> Next week. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, damn! What the hell? Damn. 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 All right, I was working, working. All right. That's pretty much like assuming, hey, you don't know how to play the game still, but you can just try this out. Start small, get bigger, right? What the heck? It's free. Holy crap. Nice free DLC? PlayStation, Kratos, and the what? Makes sense, because the whole Valhalla thing about how you go out and you God fight, War, Ragnarok's you battle every day, and every night inspired you go by the roguelike genre for an emotional, roguelike. It is a roguelike. unexpected, and fun new yeah. twist. And yes, as you saw, it is free. The team at Santa Monica Studio Insane. are fans of their fans and are fans offering of this DLC. Fans. Holy crap, God man. Rock Valhalla as a gift to the community and you'll be Trust able me, to Sony's download not hurt. it. That's well, I know, but it's like, it's not off the sale. Well, damn, the thing, damn, can, Activision generate, Blizzard. Uh, maybe you should learn from this. I don't know. All right, switching generate gears, a lot more revenue for the game. Next I mean, they might have more sales. A small independent team of developers in Australia. I love that this show can give a platform to independent creators. Their last game in 2019 was a sensation, and their next project is equally exciting and unexpected. Ah, untitled Goose Game. Untitled Moose Game. Please be a moose. <laughs> I like this. <laughs> New video game for you and your friends. I want that quap ass PlayStation game to come out. Oh, baby steps? Baby steps, yeah. Ooh, Cabrera? Ooh, there they are. Where? Oh, I see them. There's gonna be four players. I can get my friends killed. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Hey. They're like some weird, like, good times or shit. Really simplistic character designs on high realistic background. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Hello. Ring with your nose. Wow. Man, those are cool players. It does. Yeah. Oh, I'm kind wow. of excited. <laughs> kind of, this is some weird Sea of Thieves shit. Oh, oh that's way more than four players. Yeah. Everyone's like a weird, like, one of the little pecking kookaburra birds. <laughs> no, it's yeah, that the bird dipping, that yeah, drinks. The dipping, yeah, the dipping. yeah. Big Walk. By House House. 2025. Let's Jeez, go, surprise. Big Walk 2025. I'll Super be 25 fun, years right? old by then. I did a play test of that game about a year ago and had so much fun. It is a yeah, very flex special. Still flex. Game. I'm honored we got to show All right, I played it last year, bro. All right, while you're watching TGA, 
Head to TGASteamDeck.com right now. We're doing another Steam Deck giveaway. This I time it's brand new. One terabyte Bullers? Steam Deck OLED featuring an HDR OLED Terabytes. display. Enter now only Apparently the OLED the show Steam Deck is like way Steam lighter and looks way better. Chance to win Jesus. One of I mean, the old, the OLED on the Switch. Right, trust me, we are OLED just like, getting yeah. started, guys. Yeah, who, 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 so many which one of y'all is going to win a Steam Deck? Awards and musical performances ahead, including the old gods of Asgard down. from Alan Wake 2. You know, the Just system wait, it's amazing. is down. We'll be right back. The system is down. Hell yeah! Persia. I saw this one. This is this revealed. I this is this is summer. Fruit. This was revealed this, at yeah. Summer Game Fest. Yes. Yeah. It's so weird because I'm like, oh, this looks dope. Prince and then of Persia. Everyone was like, what the hell is this? What a cutie thing. I'm like, oh, no, hell yeah, dude. Oh, this looks great. Prince of Persia, Metroidvania. Hell yeah. There was some weird. I don't know. People were on some shit, man. Nah, man. nah. This looks good. He was calling y'all out. I'm calling anyone out who like this. Those people don't deserve to be listened to. There you go. Damn. Bro, this looks great. Look at this. I feel I've walked this path before. Farah. No comment. Engulfed in flames. There's nothing you can do to stop me. Yeah, I'm just gonna work out for a couple weeks, chat. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. A couple weeks. A couple weeks. Max laughs in his two, <laughs> two years of buffness. <laughs> two years of his fucking stronger, home gym. But not strong enough to save a I friend. Mean, there's some muscle memory. Yeah, I get some muscle memory. Sense of what they did with Strider. Are you yeah. courageous enough and clever enough to save your Mr. friend? King? I'll do whatever it takes. Anyway. Uh, give me six months, Chad. Give me six months. Damn, that's a badass logo. Holy yeah. crap, right? That's a diamond. Okay, I have yeah. six months. I'm excited as shit. It? When was the free demo? January 11th. Dang. Right before the game. Oh, yeah. That's what you're talking about, right? Yeah, Lego. Oh, Fortnite. I mean, I, I saw this all over like Twitter and I was like, okay. So it's not the world. No! So it's just the characters, not the world. Not the song! Well, you do. You. Build Lego. So it's build mode, but Lego mode. Damn, they never really sold that building part. We're smashing rocks. There you go. Yep. Building with Legos. There you yeah. go. Wow. What it's meant to be Minecraft. And is this permanent Jesus. now, chat? Lego Minecraft. Until they take it out of the, the game. So they're like, oh, nobody like this one around. No, this is gonna be. Oh yeah. Well, that's not apparently sad. 160 pe million people were playing it concurrently earlier. Today. Yes, it was. It was 160 million yeah. concurrently. It players. was tough. For that's me to, impossible. No, no, it was tough for me to log in today. I was having trouble because I wanted to see the Lego show. Yeah, what was the number? If it's 16 million, did I times it by 100 in my head? 160 billion. It's permanent. According to the chat. Oh, 1.6 million. Man, it's a little bit less. 1.6 concurrent is still, is still a lot. But 160 million. <laughs> it gets you to go, what the fuck? 2.4, 2.4, I've seen multiple. 2.4 million today. That's still insane. That's still insane. This is this is nice, but you know what they need? Rumble Night. That's what they need to bring in here. If they're bringing Rumble Night. to that. Yeah, it is definitely. Rumble versus Fortnite. You know what there is on. And it's, uh, there's like a, like almost every skin that you unlock is a Lego mode now. Like with the exception of some other like you know like companies like maybe DC doesn't have it but Marvel. Oh DC definitely. Not the ones that I've seen. I mean they own Travelers though. Yeah, but I have Catwoman and DC characters that are not Lego. I checked this morning. Oh, that sucks. The Marvel characters uh, and certain Star Wars characters are Legos. Um, oh. Like wait, you get to skip Breath of the Wild stuff? Please like you get crazy welcome. like physics okay. things and items well, and using it stuff. Made it fucking. I'm sorry. Tears of the yeah. Kingdom. Yeah. The Kingdom, and they have like a race version coming out. Is there too. a Beerus Lego? Um, I don't think Dragon Ball. <laughs> no, Dragon Ball's not. Performing an original. Yeah, rocket racing from our tomorrow. Upcoming game, Senua Saga Hellblade 2. I'm proud to introduce to you to one of my favorite bands, Hylum. There you go. DMC time. Damn. So wait, you, you waited in the lobby and they wouldn't let you in, but then you finally got in. Did you play it? Uh, no, I just wanted to see what characters were Legos. So you never played it, you just, you just saw it? I just saw it, yeah. Oh, I didn't just, have time, because it was Game Awards. Oh, it was today. 
Yeah, it was today. It literally came out today. Yeah, I looked at my log. Yeah, that's, it, it. that's why there's so many people playing right now. So yeah, it just came out. It just came out, yeah. Fortnite's kind of popular. A little yeah. bit. Steve waited like hours and hours to get an Eminem concert. Yeah. How was it? Uh, it was short, but it was pretty good. But it wasn't as good as... Um, uh, I saw... It wasn't as good as uh, what you said. So. <laughs> DJ whatever? No, not ASAP Rock. Yeah. I saw a GIF of Eminem performing in concert, and then it cut to like the audience and people screaming and cheering him on, and it was like John Cena. And yeah, yeah, that was a uh, that was a fucking Leon Kennedy. Like, Kennedy. It's yeah. the only and game that can pull Miles out. Morales like yeah, 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 crazy out, and I was like, wow. I think the only game that probably has as many characters or more than um, than Smash. I think Smash. Well, has Marshmallow second. had one. Smash. Well, Fortnite has way more than Smash. It's just that. As I've always said, it's cool, but like... Travis Scott. Travis Scott, thank you. Smash, nice. they do a lot so of they have work like any gold in the back? Oh, They're not skins. What? Yeah. yeah. What'd you say, Well, Smash doesn't have anywhere near as much as Fortnite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Fortnite, they're just skins. They, uh, yeah, exactly. They're, they're skins right. that go over and they do all the same things. Well, whatever. Smash is specific Maybe characters. they'll get an exclusive. Yeah, there's a design mode. They'll yeah. maybe get an exclusive thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. that's it. It's otherwise, it's like, it's just a skin. The cover, right. Well, that's how they're able to do it, is because of the fact that they can just make skins, you know? That's actually really dope. You just throw anything they want. And then there. you get weird things where, like, Pete, like you know, Peter has to be all big and bug. Uh, you know, it can't be a fat Peter version. Right, yeah, yeah. Which like, is weird because it's like, oh, well, that'll screw up the hitbox. And I'm like, or you can just ignore it and just have his hitbox be the normal characters, even though he is Oh, that would probably cause a bunch of problems. It probably would. I don't know. I mean, especially when you're trying to hide or something like that. I mean, that. hiding, yes, you're going to be obvious. Or when you're, yeah, but, it, when I mean, you're that's just creating those boxes, but, things. But Beerus has the same problem. His ears stick out of the cars and everything. Yeah. Um, they could have just, they could have just said, forget it. He has the same hitbox as everyone. He's just bad. I think there was an issue with like the, the marshmallow guy too. The the uh, marshmallow, the, uh, you know, the DJ or whatever. Um, his hitbox was weird because of his, his you know, giant marshmallow oh, baby. Look, man, Fortnite is, is going through the test of time right now, man. As much as we, we enjoy aren't... Enjoy like, all last. Exactly. As just much as we it. aren't as big fans of it. It's like Smash, it, right? Just enjoy it. It's It won't last ridiculous. forever. It's oh, ridiculous. they go straight into a Hellblade trailer. Smart. It's been a while. I was just, just playing on the trailer. Damn. This place I honestly thought that music was for God of War. Do you hear it? One day this game will come out. Okay. Okay. The heartbeat of the lost ones. I can feel them on my skin. Each death inked in blood. I won't stop fighting for them. <laughs> It'll come out the same day Wukong does. Until the very last beat. Fates away. Is that in game? Yes. Holy shit. It's all definitely all in engine. Yeah, I've noticed that this this trailer is kind of lower fidelity than the other trailers. So they might might have had to render it at 1080p. You want the truth? All the lives inside me tell me to let go. Yeah, they switched to UE5, did they not? One of the first games to get Unreal 5 engine outside of Epic. It's, it's big. Yeah, what are like massive UE5 games that have technically come out? It's about to be Tekken. <laughs> Fortnite, yeah. It was also the uh, the the Not Souls game, Lords of Shadow, Lords of the Fallen. Remnant was as well. Oh, Robocop was also UE5, really. Assassin's Creed. Well, no, my finger card. Well, we'll give you a year. We yeah? We think it'll be next year. Hmm. It'll be like 2024. We've been, we've been seeing, 
trailers for that before the Xbox One was. Play a demo on Game Pass. Out. Excellent. Twenty twenty four. Hopefully. All right, what an amazing new look at the gameplay and world of Hellblade 2 coming in 2024 to Xbox, PC, and Game Pass. Now to present our next okay, award, pass. please welcome a former Game Award winner nominated tonight for Best Fighting Game, the creative director of NetherRealm Studios. What the Boone. heck? Okay. Edward okay. And you're an Eddie! Yeah, all right. That's funny because it's for his, like, it's hanging out. It's his own game. All right? His own game is getting nominated. He's coming to Eric. But is it not going right? right. 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 to so right. weird. Yeah. All right, we'll do this. Hey. Hey. Nice little present presentation. Shh, 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 shh. Tonight's nominees for Best Narrative got us all in their drama. And best their Narrative is what he's, he's up here and for. Yes. I'm actually tossed some up weird stuff the we can't explain. On this. Here are the nominees. What's in here then? What did I, what did I predict was going to win this? It's here! I should get a taco! Story. It's either going to be Alan Wake 2 or VC3, right? Monsters. Definitely Zelda's in the best right. Even Jessica made note of that. She's like, the story of this game sucks. <laughs> yeah, it does! It does! We have unexpected guests! What we good? No matter how bitter the truth is. No. <laughs> Not going to 16. Me and Max, like, no. Unfortunately, no. Spider-Man no. 2 is pretty good. Dude, the most story. Good lord. I finally beat it, dude. This game is freaking think, awesome. They, they, dude, last quarter of the game is amazing. Stupid good, man. The award goes to. Alan Wake 2. Yeah, oh. I think I was leaning on that one. Pretty good. If, if, I, if, I, if, we, if I pull out the. Uh, Pod on mine. I was like, I'm really torn between this and Valve's game, but I think it might go to Alan. No one's asked me to play this Alan Wake game. No. Not a single person. Yeah. I should try it. So I'm like, Alan Wake's got like this. F the naysayers. Uh, I should uh, try it. Straightforward narrative. Valve's game is like, there's so many different ways. To yeah, yeah. yeah. You fabricate. So it's like, which answer. one is the, which one of the, Alan which one are they gonna go with? From the beginning. Is it an ominous game? It's spooky. Spooky? It, it's, it's like, um, I it's like Twin Peaks. With the ah. whole narrative team, the writers, okay, like uh, Peaks, Clay, man. Tyler, Tinika, narrative like designers who made the story like, uh, in the gameplay, Simone, Molly, uh, the whole narrative hey, team. Dude, uh, so he went to that team, no wonder, uh, uh, Ed. On C, uh, that guy used to work uh, for uh, NetherRealm Studios. Yeah. Dominic, yeah. Dominic, yeah. So now he works on Alan Wake team. All the wonderful actors. Wow. Here tonight, some of them, Melanie, uh, Ilka, uh, yeah, I was like, it's it's Mac between Alan Wake and Valley's Gate. But the whole, sure. the whole cast, this doesn't surprise wonderful me, actors, the and, and the song the makers threats. who made custom music, custom songs to extend the story. Here tonight, later, Poets of the Fallen, Old Gods of Asgard, Poe, uh, This Road, every song maker coming Jesus. through Fright Music. For huh. our chapter of songs. Perfect space. We've been talking about the music Thank you. a lot. Uh, this narrative award. We wanted to push things yeah. further. Because yeah. do something new, and it's always a risk. Yeah, yeah, come on. For you to embrace it and understand. <laughs> Play the music. Let the that is so fun, man. Spin his yarn. Come on. Let the narrative man have his narrative. I know. You see that clap? It was super fast. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, wrap it up, Chief. Get the hell off the <laughs> stage! <laughs> GTFO music. <laughs> this is the Virtual Fighter, Max. This is Virtual Fighter. Artist to stay. What I said, you're so sorry to go because she's dead. Many me and I want to meet up with the mass. It's pretty messed up, man. Let him finish. What I said, you're a lot of work. I know, like, what I said, you're a lot of work. I know, like, what I said, you're a lot of work. I know, like, what I said, you're a lot of work. I know, like, what I until now. <laughs> you may have recognized that incredible creator who built her own for? independent Adobe. studio in yeah, Tokyo. Uh, she wanted to show you what mm. she's been working on before she's even signed it with a publisher Ghost or Wire. a platform. I said, come to this show. Just show it to the audience and the fans first. So that's what we're going to do. We're honored to have her back at the Game Awards. Please give a warm welcome to Akumi Nakamura. Oh, it's a spooky lady. I, I'm like, having some time putting this together. I'm like, that's right. Yeah. She was the Ghost Wire yeah, Tokyo. Tokyo Ghost Wire. Well, she left her. Damn. She's spooky. Wow. Just, just... I see. Maybe amazing game. EMT Simulator again. <laughs> Start playing the music. Hi, Akumi Nakamura desu. Konnichiwa. <laughs> And the chat goes very happy. <laughs> I'm super excited to be on this <laughs> stage again. Thank you. Uh, first, oh. <laughs> first, I want to say thank you to the Anshin artist 
見てる<笑> And you, thank you, 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 all of you. You know, she's adorable. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> Nothing has changed. <laughs> yeah. Your support yeah, changed my life. No, my mother. Yeah. Sad. And my, like, right after. And Simmons knows his birthday. Today, yeah. he's born, uh, I am honored in... to introduce Last our year? Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Kimberly. It's time to see the unseen. She must be protected. <laughs> Internet. Bye bye. So she's the director of a studio. Yeah, she went independent. Yeah. yeah so she was working with Bethesda technically. Yeah. Right before on, on Ghostwire, and then after that game came out, they put this out. As the, out she can't. She quit the project before it was done. Well, as most of the do. Oh, this is an artsy yeah. game. Uh, quit as in falling out, or just needed to move on? No, they just, you it's know... Hard to say, really? They just, I don't know, she probably just didn't... Probably work, wasn't able to do exactly what she wanted to do creatively, and, yeah. you know, a bunch of other people probably felt the same way. How it usually goes, right? I mean, yep. when you're owned by... I mean, this uh, almost looks like Ghostwire. When your company's it's owned really by a big Ghostwire. company who's owned by an even bigger company... Yeah, you can't do much. Everything has to get approved, and so... Oh, is this Too many hands in the cookies. It's almost like, like a multiplayer game. Multiplayer Ghostwire, almost. Yeah. So many incredible projects tonight. Thank you, Akumi. Now, tonight, it's not lost on me that all of our Game of the Year nominees are from big, established franchises. And while we all love a big sequel, it's important to use a place like TGA to introduce you to brand new worlds, like what you just saw with Kamuri, and like this project. My it's a brand new world. Oh my God. Yeah, it's a new IP. New IP, but I thought it would be she Monster Hunter World, too. Like mm. <laughs> you know, I thought. Yeah. That's a stretch, man. Hey, yeah, you know, I'm trying here. I'm trying to get the, get the chat some gifts up. Black sail. And another cool, let's give us a cool a pirate co-op game. Come on. This has a great looking style to it. God damn. Yeah. It looks like a super cool, like, uh, old school Diablo. Yeah. Is this a stray devs? Good wow. lord. What the Jeez. fuck? Nutty this looks like what's that one? Yeah. It's one one two D game where it's like the man raised his hand across the steel's face, and it's like it's like two D like RPG ish. Yeah, I don't know exactly what I'm fucking talking. Darkest Dungeon, yeah, it's like three D Darkest Dungeon. It's a great style. It is Moon. What the fuck? Moon Studio. Ori? What? It the is heck? Moon. Whoa! Uh, <laughs> Whoa! Remember, Whoa! Is wow! Go to RPG next. Remember that. Uh -oh. oh my god damn! Alright, yes. immediately super interested. <laughs> Holy crap, they're doing an RPG action game. Like a Diablo like. Yeah, they said they wanted an RPG action game. Now I don't want to do Of course it was like, dude, why are the yeah, visuals so know. good? Now I know why the RPG. Dude, they're doing a violent like Diablo like. Holy shit. Oh, I know why the art looks so good. I'm, yeah, we're su I'm super in. <laughs> They're based like Vanillaware West. Yeah, exactly. It's, it looks yeah. like Vanillaware. No, and it's got the music guys. Uh, Gareth, I think Cockler is his name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gareth. Uh, no rest for the win. Cool! Hell yeah, brother! Yeah, that's... First? Uh, I love first. it that it's like hyper-violent. It's like... Yeah, they're going in on that one. And Steam. I played this two years ago. It was fun. This is PS5. More information is coming March first. That's in PS5. Wicked Inside Showcase. What the fuck? During the Game Awards, viewers in the U.S. can enter to win one of the most nice. Why not? That's that's an Xbox game. Moon Studios is Xbox. It's just coming out of PS5. They're not owned by Are they not? To enter for your chance to win. I could have sworn Moon Studios was like. Completely scooped up. Yeah, Private Division was the publisher. Oh, okay, that's why. Okay, okay, okay. Wow, that was just like, wait, is this a main Xbox game just coming out on PlayStation? What the fuck? Is that just, it's the Switch 2. I'm not excited. This is that Lenovo, yeah, Lenovo, yeah. I'm like, it's the Switch 2. Everyone has a Switch thing. now. Del Taco is gonna have a Switch. The nice. best discoveries are the nice. ones you I want to see the Steam OLED thing you guys are talking about. I, I thought seen that it. It's recent. Uh, some people were talking about it that yeah. uh, I'm like friends with, and they're like, oh my Go god. Go to that website. Try to win one while we're watching it. <laughs> All right. Both sites are broken, apparently. OLED. Got more pizza coming. So have, have they actually more? seen it? Okay, cool. Yeah, it's out. It is. It's in people's hands right 
Damn, that game looks fucking cool. If it's co-op in some way too, I'm really wondering. Yeah, well, I, yeah, I don't know if it's. If it, is it like one of the? It I'm, looks Diablo like, right? Yeah, right. Is it like Diablo or is it? Four Man, like? it looks cooler no, than Diablo, right? Because it has, has that, a, be, a better art style. It, yeah, it has yeah, a better it's, art it's style. Gonna, like, show more it's and more. It looks old school and new at the same time, which is so nice. So there's supposed to be a big Xbox game here. That's not it. Oh man, well, that was an in, that was an independent publisher. That's technically yeah. indie. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay. There you go. Hell yeah. Hello. So this is PS5. This is the PS5 version. Yeah, I haven't even seen the PS5 version. Yeah, you're but it's, at I saw some people playing on Twitch. It's fucking These insane, guys. dude. I'm gonna show it to you guys play. after this to be yeah. like, get ready. It's the best looking game there is. Yeah, like we're on PC, like me and him last night. I, I was like awestruck. I was like, holy god. Wait, it's on PC? That's what we're playing. It's on. It's on PC. It's the new. You remember how Crisis used to be that game where it's like, oh man, can your can your can your computer run Crisis? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before it explodes. It's so it's so insane looking that it's like I can't believe. Was your was your computer starting to run hot? Not even. Really, but it just looks good. It's entertaining. So it's well optimized. Yeah. I mean, yeah, this is the PS5 version. This would be like 500 gigs um, if it was like uh, Call of Duty. Yeah. <laughs> right? I had an up to Call like, of Duty and I had to delete I, I another gonna, game. I, I, had to, I wanted to re download RE4 and I'm like, you need to make space. I'm like, hey, what's taking up all the space? I thought God, I, day, God it was 220. Yes. Yeah. I was like, when you go into battle, yes. three? Just, oh, just, for, just for God. Just for like, I think it's Warzone on the map. Look at me. I guess. Yeah. But like, I'm your PS5. It's Warzone now. and Modern Warfare. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm, your, I'm your PS5 the now. entire It's basically 100 each. Look at me. I was like, so dumb. I, I upgraded my hard drive you know, years ago. I was like, no, nah, I'm not doing this. Oh, you put the, the two TV? I got, I got the external and I got the internal. Really I was like, nope. Outstanding I was like, gaming. nope. And now to talk about some of the biggest games, it's a pleasure to welcome from the Muppets. That's right, the Here Great Gonzo. Gonzo! Oh, oh God. Thank you. Let's go! He's scared me. Suit. It's great to be here. Hello, everybody. You look at all the hey, security buddy, guys. Actually, right there, one right Gonzo, there. Gonzo's like is more tailored. Kind of wearing what I'm wearing? Yeah, it's like looking in a mirror, isn't it? <laughs> well, I really well, thank you. That was really though. <laughs> that was actually really well done. <laughs> so, 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 what have you been playing? Seriously, what have you been playing? Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Gonzo's, Gonzo's buying, buying everyone popcorn, popcorn tonight. tonight. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> All right, that was a good one. You got me. Well played, Jeff. Yeah, well, thank you. Nice Seriously, though, like what Western have you it. been playing? Yeah, it's Taylor. Yeah. Well, lots and lots of Tears of the Kingdom. What an incredible <laughs> Even Gonzo you knows. Know one mission where you follow the cuckoo up a hill? I lost knows. track of how many Gonzo days I spent made. doing that. Oh, yeah. The objective is really, you know, just follow the chicken. You don't have to ask me twice. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. You love your chicken. So I guess that was your favorite part. What did you think of the ending? Oh, I never get past that cuckoo mission. I keep restarting to see if I can get a slower time. <laughs> All right, well, any other great gaming highlights this year for you, Gonzo? Are you kidding? Actually, if you have the time. Hey, you, you guys got a minute? <laughs> I'd like to show you how many of this year's greatest games all revolve around one central theme. Check this out. <laughs> wow. You got the case for it? Yeah, that's quite a conspiracy you've uncovered. I you know, know I know. Stuff. You probably think I'm a <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I appreciate video games beyond this one very specific interest. I mean, yeah, I think we're all thinking that. <laughs> yeah, maybe. What do you think, Zelda? Zelda? <laughs> Random hilarious yes, copy, is that say? Let's this IRL! <laughs> Come on! Probably a copy of a game. Unbelievable. All right, here are the nominees for best debut oh, oh, indie game. <laughs> Dave the Diver. Best debut indie game. All right, what's going to be, folks? Didn't you play this? I beat it. Yeah. It's good, but I have no idea what it's about. <laughs> Just things. It's cool. Tell you. It's probably going to be Pizza Tower. This game gets a lot of... We should play this. Yeah. We should play this. There's uh, another I mean, one. Wait, what's there was another one that was like some yeah. underwater one that everyone was losing their minds over. Oh, did this game wow. come out? You find it's crazy. Man, that's crazy. I think go. I think View Tower. Just because what I saw for the 
Just that, seconds. just that three seconds. Yeah. All right, the great Gonzo. Thank you, Gonzo. That's a new and now tower. to the task at hand. The game yeah. award goes to Cocoon. Cocoon. Damn. I mean, that is a surprise. Shot. I was like, wait, what? Wow. I mean, it was like, oh, no. Yo. I was like, OK, was sure, whatever. The guy was shocked? Yeah. yeah. The guy was like, he was like what? what? He was like, hey, no way. Damn. Damn. I was like, wait, I, pizza tower. We yeah. beat them? Yeah. I beat Cocoon. That's cool. This is a bit of a shape of water moment where I'm like, I beat it. It's good. It's, this is the best debut in it. I don't know. That's boy's heavy. Well, I didn't play any of the other debut winnings except Dredge, so. Thank you so much. Uh, the team from Geometric couldn't make it out tonight, uh, but they wanted us to pass along. I'm his neighbor. For mm -hmm. The team couldn't make it out because they, they were they were like, nah, we're not winning this. Yeppi, Mads, and Jakob, and everyone at the team at Geometric. <laughs> Down the so street. Such a wonderful partner on this game. Put on pads? No. <laughs> nah. I was not your chance. Ah. It's not your turn. Please be this way. It's not yeah. your turn. These people were like not expecting to win. No, 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 no. Completely unprepared. Yeah, I don't know that. I had no idea what was going on. Like, you're supposed to say something. No show up. up. Google Play will be awarding the most anticipated title with their Play More Award. Well, it's not like a fence. So it's just like a rope. Bro. Bro. It's stanchion. It's, it's something to stop the and a goon in front of everyone. But you gotta understand, the, the stupid kid, he went with the crew. Yeah. Yes. So, like... Never, no, we're not talking about him. Okay, I was like... Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah don't give that person stop. any more attention than it's they just, just, just let, 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 let it die. Okay, okay. So it's like, oh, that stuff doesn't work. There's a Sega game back there. Yeah, they had Sonic sound effects. Mm hmm. Some new energy. Yeah. Oh, this is totally it. Oh, it's, oh. It was a virtual fighter glove, bro. Wow. Yes. Are they all coming into a new fighting game? No, this is it. The new mini really? Of course I did. Collection? Genesis Collection. What? Jet set. Okay. W wow. Jet set. Wait. Oh, what's fighting? that? Early what the fuck? Thing? What was that? Oh, Shinobi. it's everything. This is a it's sh Shinobi. Shinobi. It's a Golden, Golden Axe. This is a new console. Uh, fucking jet set. Oh, what the hell? Now in development. Oh, dude. Dude, it was like seven games or some shit. Oh! Holy shit! Oh, okay. So wow. Wow. It was, dude, it was literally everything but VM. <laughs> <laughs> it was virtual literally everything games. but Virtual yeah. Fighter. Wow. Games in one trailer. So many memories for all of us. All and more. Are First of the many brand new games in development and set for release over the next several years. Many. Thanks oh. to Sega for it's that. New it's new age Sega. Incredible. Basically, we're like, all right, we're breaking, right, we're breaking the back. We're breaking, yeah, we're, we're fucking, we're back. We're resurrection. Hell yeah, dude! We had a Streets of Rage not too long ago. Yeah, it's a, it's a brand new Sega made Streets yeah. of Rage. Wow. Holy shit. Sandland? No, Dragon Ball? No, no Sandland. I lose this Dragon Ball! I lose this Dragon Ball! We have to keep Damn. them in contracts. We have to keep oh. them in contracts. It does look pretty good. Yeah, Jesus. I didn't, I didn't think this was going to happen at this show. Jeez. Tremble before my power. Nice. I'll show you the horror. Looking pretty good. I heard he's going to be in Fortnite too. Frieza? Yeah. I wonder if all those like. Smaller projects did for Sega. Finally convinced them. Oh no, there's an audience here. Oh, yeah. There's an audience here. You guys just aren't seen. I, I find it hilarious, dude. It was literally everything but the F. Yeah. Yeah. Streets but of Rage, Golden it's Axe, clear. a 2D hand drawn shit. I'm shocked they, they made a new uh, version. Crazy, crazy fucking taxi. taxi. Yeah, Crazy Taxi. Yeah. That's nuts, man. What's the music gonna be like? <laughs> Alright, dude. We have to go back and watch it. Yeah. The thing is, even if it wasn't VF, whoa. Even if it wasn't VF, it was like the best thing they could have shown. 
you know, here's yeah. all Jet Set Radio. Commitment, commitment to our commitment to our, commitment to our legacy, yeah. right? Yeah. So, like, so yeah, but they said and more. And v, more. VF is definitely VF coming. VF is dude. in there. VF is, is coming. If, if all that shit is happening, VF is in, is in there. Oh yeah. God. Telling myself. Super massive was the guys that made it. Oh, but yeah, the Wendigo game. Trying like the, the dark, dark story, pictures, dark pictures, yeah. yeah. More zombies? Yeah, I'm really excited for that Sega announcement, to be honest. It was literally the next best thing they could have done. I even made a joke where it's like, what is this, a trailer for a new Golden Axe? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I made that joke. Where it's, and it literally well, fucking was, but it wasn't Golden, just Golden Axe. Golden Axe is multiplayer, I'm with it. That's what I mean, that would be fun. I yeah. hope that Street Race is as good as 4. Oh my god. 4 was fire. 4, from the way four was pretty fire. So. Didn't they just add like more DLC to that or something? No. That, was, well, that was two years ago. That was, like, that's a new developer. That's like a 3D Street Race. Oh. Seems unnecessary. What, what are you gonna hit? But the guy? Why would you make that? Right? Oh, so it's a story mode. For oh, it's a Dead by Daylight story, story game. Yeah. The world of Dead by Daylight. Interesting. That's right, two huge names in the horror yeah, genre, Dead by Daylight, Dead by Daylight and Supermassive Games are coming together. Sega trailer wins everything so far, bro. Experience, the casting of Frank I want to go back and watch that as soon like, as oh, possible. Yeah, yeah, what the fuck? And it's, and it's everything. It's return to a world we haven't seen in quite some time. A world? <laughs> yeah. This looks, is this Pokemon? Yeah, right. Come on. So this is like Pokemon 30 years. Jesus Christ, I mean. They will Mana! Visions of Mana! They will never put effort into any Pokemon game, huh? No, so this is uh, God damn. This is Visions of Mana. Dark Cloud 3. So, like, sequel to S Secret of Mana? Like. Well, a new Mana game. Yeah, like a new one, right? By the oh, it definitely oh be. God. Damn, that's some big the production. Big boys here. Puts a budget into a Mana game. Well, it's, a, it's an action RPG. An action RPG Zelda game. You know? It's Square Enix Breath of the Wild. I mean, they don't usually give Mana games much budget. Not really. They got a remake recently. Well, not that long ago, that kind of sucked, right? It was okay. It was like, it's alright. It's only okay. It's alright. And somebody at Square loves this shit. God damn. A 300 hour minimum game. Yeah, this is the mana. <laughs> cool. Oh, yeah, that's intriguing. a pretty cool looking game. Hey, that's what Square Enix is up to after In FF. 2024. Damn, that's what they're up to after Rebirth. There's something that's not Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. What's the fuck? More PlayStation stuff. Oh, Give it to us. What's Rise of the Ronin, please? Yeah, is this, is this gonna be the not drum. Tsushima? Yeah, they're not Tsushima. A fleeting moment. Yeah. What the fuck? For those caught in its deadly rhythm. And a lifetime can pass in the blink of an eye. Okay. For anyone embracing its bitter man fate. The only thing we know for sure is that time marches forward. Even if we are apart, still we are one. Without hesitation. <laughs> Not Tsushima, man. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's Tsushima in the 1800s. Without remorse. If the drum drives the rhythm, I'm already seeing a lot of Neo. Then the river directs the flow. Let's do this together. Uh, yeah. Dude. Like to it, like, yeah, that looked like at least two player co op. Oh, well, like, well, don't Neo games have co op? They do, technically, right? But it's like Souls co op. That did look good. Let us not forget the pain of Master Show and the countless who have suffered. Ooh, that looks cool. As the smoke rises, <clears throat> so shall so, we. So, <clears throat> will the narrative actually be followable? 
is the next question. Because the story in all these games, like, and there was the same thing for the one that came out earlier this year, too. It's just impossible to follow. Cat's like, nope. That looks really good. Whoa, that is coming out That is uh, our... way sooner than I thought it was going to be. Holy shit. Uh, that's, that's right on the horizon. That's Rise of the Ronin coming to PlayStation in 2024. Now it is time to announce winners in a number of other categories. Wow. Here are the nominees for best action game. Armored Core 6, Fires of Rubicon. I said Armored Core is going to win. Dead Island 2, yeah, I Ghost Runner 2. I'd I like High Five. I think I'd like High Five. I'd, I'd like High Five, but I think and the Armored Game Award Ball. goes to yeah, Armored Core 6, it's from Fires of Rubicon. Oh, it's, it's from oh, Sony. Oh, 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 oh. Here are the nominees for Best Art Direction. High Five. Zelda. Alan Wake 2. High Five mm. Rush. It should be High Five Rush. High Five. High five. It should be High Five. It'll be Alan Wake 2. Super Mario for the... the... Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. Alan Wake 2. And the Game Award goes to... Alan Wake 2. Seven's good yeah. shit. <laughs> Seven's is 10 for 10. Here are the nominees for Best VR AR. Gran Turismo Probably 7. Gran Turismo. Humanity. Should be Resident Evil. Horizon, it should be Horizon, the Horizon the Mountain Ass. Evil Village VR mode. Well, I, this one I don't know. Either the Rise or Gran Turismo. Turismo. Okay, wow. Well, nice. nice. yeah, okay, okay, Jesus I got, I got one. I got one. I'll take you, pay off. I'll take it. For best mobile game. Final Fantasy this is going to Hong Kong. Honkai. Honkai. Monster Hunter. Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty Island, Island is fucking <laughs> sick as fuck, Hunter bro. And Terra Nell. Come on, and Hello Kitty, just for the memes. It's going to be Monster Hunter. Honkai. Come on, Hello Kitty, bro. That's what the chat wanted. All right, we have much more game awards to come, including the first I, I ever called action and art. The old I, like, I know what they're going to go with. Alan Wake oh, Two, oh, like, and some of our biggest game announcements are still to come. Oh, really? But right now, we'd like you to meet one of tonight's nominees for best debut indie game, who is also part of the newly inducted. Chat, do I have any gift subs? Was Crazy Taxi on our list? Hang on one second. <laughs> Hang on one second. How do you call Crazy Taxi, though? It was Crazy Taxi. Like, what you the hell? You paused it! I grew up. I had a... Oh, God. Whoa, hey, that's oh, nice! Jesus. At the age of 12, Probably. it was a whole new world for me. For many uh, of the days and families. Food is not no. just a thing. I never to called it. But right? Also, I never called it. Thing. You said Chrono Trigger 2D HD? You. What the and fuck? Who did that? It was Mono. That dealt with Mono. It ended well. They put Chrono Trigger, Trigger, Trigger in there. What the fuck? Uh, uh, you said a racing. You said a racing? Nope. That technically crazy taxi is not a racing game. Not a racing game. Oh, you take the GTA 6 out. Everybody That's gone. No, but he's saying like anything, like maybe a second trailer. They are not going to do that. They can mention it. They can mention it. Yeah, that's probably about it. Well, guess what? If they mention it, did you read it? You won't meet 25 years old. Oh, is that what it is? That's what it said. Oh, that's what it said? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. GTA I just want to be sure. GTA part of the game. I just want to be sure. Okay. GTA is part of the game award. Anything I did? I, did I miss anything? Yeah, the the Ed trailer is probably on its way. Yeah, Ed is probably definitely coming. We don't have to. Oh yeah, I had life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, dude, it, dude, they literally showed like Jackie Bryant's glow in that trailer. No, that was Axel's. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Yeah. Like I, I, I was right. thinking the same thing, but when Link thinking back that it's oh, everything right. was directly referential yeah. of a thing that they showed. Right. Poor, confused. Oh, God, oh, Lord. Uh, God, Outlast Trials. I played it. Wait, wait, grind the, wait, do we have to it's grind the fun. children? What up, man? Welcome in. I need more people to jump in, though. But the miracles of science give you purpose. Oh, my breed, oh, thank you. Sometimes the finger of God reaches down and touches you. The VR just first, uh, first person. Uh, I got on my steam deck. Last trial. Yeah. I didn't find it to be scary. It was just, <laughs> it's not as scary as people are making it. Yeah, I'm making it all. You know. It's just very. It's very. <laughs> Seems like it actually wasn't that scary. Yeah, it wasn't that scary. I don't know. <laughs> These guys hey, out was about. was Lethal Company more scary? Lethal Company. Yes. I've never because, played it before. Because you know why? Because it was uh, the atmosphere. Yep. Yeah. This this place is just. Uh, 
you know, you're in uh, either the, the vile of dungeon or, or prison uh, or something like that. I'm playing that this weekend, by the way. Yeah. Okay, welcome back to the Game Awards, and are you ready? It is time are to get a world ready? premiere from one of our industry's greatest creators. He's Kojima. been a huge supporter of the Game Awards since the very beginning back in 2014, Kojima. and tonight... I am so, Definitely so honored to share this latest update with you. Death Stranding. On his the way he's, uh, <laughs> his the way he's hyping it up, it's Death Stranding. The twinkle in his eye. No, yeah. The twinkle in his eye. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Oh, oh, oh wow, I'm so Jeff, shocked. We have no idea. I'm so shocked. Oh, wow. Oh, this is uh, Horizon. Wait, that's real? No, that's a, that's a real person. Yeah, I was going to say, that's a real person. What the fuck? That's the game does. Yeah, but that's an actor. Yeah, it's a fucking TikTok filter. The jabbering crab and the mad whale and started vending and cracking. This is not that stranding. Different game. Yeah. Hey, that's an actor, though. He looks a little way older. Oh, that guy? Sing his fox. The jabbering crap and the mad way. Definitely not Death Stranding. Isn't this the game that Xbox game? Isn't this the game that leaked a while ago? I think it did. Yeah. Is this the, is this the, the Xbox project? Maybe? I think it is. This is the game that leaked a while ago. Hmm, Detroit becoming human more. It is a trailer. OLED. OD. OD. Yeah, that's right. It's unreal. Never mind. The screamers. Yeah, the Xbox game. Yeah, it's like leaked. There was like some weird scenes of very Kojima y. So not Death Stranding? It's not Death Stranding. It's, oh, it's, it's, awesome. it's, it's a spooky Kojima game. Oh, thank goodness. Well, I'll take it. Alright, some boys is standing OD, there. OD because PT. What? That's the PT door. Kojima. Nice shoes. Jesus. Oh my god, god bro. Like, nice like, shoes. Jesus, you know. This man my is, best friend. This man is on himself so hard. He's my best friend. How come you never introduced me like that? <laughs> Your glowing door. Welcome, Mr. Kojima, back to the Game Awards. <laughs> they put a big you need more prestige. Oh, yeah. yeah. shit. That's true. Uh, you need a, you need a so golden you logo jacket. Shit. I got bling on him, too. Golden, yeah, okay, so he's got bro. ice on him, dude. Bro. He's got some bling. What in the hell? He's bling. Look at his bling. He's, he's, got, look at, he's got diamonds on him. That's his company logo. Jacket. What the hell, man? I'm really glad to be at the 10th G. Uh, this man's uh, done harder than a rapper. What the I'm fuck? I'm really happy to show the new title, OD. Kojima! This title will feature Gifted some gift subs. Oh. Thank you. OD. Uh, thank you, Kojima. I'm just one of the voices. I don't know how you're doing this while on stage. Of course, what kind of game are you making, Mr. Kojima? Right, you got that drill. This is this the previous one was stranding. This is branding. This is branding game. I like it. That's branding. Oh, he's working with Xbox, yeah. ヌーバー、ありがとうございます。so I really like to always challenge new things, groundbreaking things, and that's my kind of. I'm rule. so groundbreaking. Uh, but this one, uh, with uh, help of Xbox, well, it smells Xbox good. Studios, mm -hmm. and using their uh, cloud gaming technology, um, I'm kind of doing this uh, together. But it's it's really to make immersive, and also something that never no one has seen before is what I'm trying to <laughs> do. Not it is, it is a game. It's, Don't get it's me something wrong. That... But it's. At the same time, a movie, but at the same time, a new form of media. Oh. <laughs> so we can't wait to learn more about what you're working on. This bitch is making Dark Seed. Dark Seed 3. Dark this bitch is three. just making Dark Seed 3. Yes. It's something new, but something that's never been seen, but also oh. new. Uh-oh. Drake. Everyone, please welcome 
Jordan oh, Peele. Oh, Jordan Peele's a part of it? He's working with Jordan Peele. Yo. Of course he is. Interesting. He has a course Okay. He is. All right. He's all working right. with Jordan Peele. All what right. I'm moving. You know what I'm saying? That's gonna, yeah, all right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's see what they're going to do. Good right. combo. That's kind of sick. sick. How's it going? Oh my gosh, oh what my are they God. making? Jordan, welcome to the Game Awards. That what combo is got Wait, leaked. Simmons, you said this got leaked? A big fan of there were some right? scenes that got leaked like a year ago. Icon, what it, well, I guess I'm, and, uh, I'm I, I can like just, I can I say, it looks like a movie. The first oh, moment, there you go. Looks like a movie. I played Metal Gear Solid 2. There you go. I knew I was experiencing the work of an artist whose craft. Yeah, I know. Both of them shoes is kicking. And he's been an right. inspiration to me, and the opportunity to collaborate with him Damn. is truly incredible. Okay. In my films, I'm always trying to maximize the immersion, put the audience into the main character's shoes. Like I, think is, is I think this is. I think this is Jordan Peele's first video game. Then. On a whole yeah. At least official Nova. involvement. Like right. Well. Exactly. Yeah. It'd be interesting and to see if he actually goes in the gaming is after this. Completely immersive, utterly terrifying, and I am absolutely honored. I'm down for Spooky Kojima. I'm, I'm down for Spooky Kojima. No, I'm, down for, I'm more down for that than Death Stranding 2. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. To be honest, yeah. to be honest, yeah. Yeah. To be honest after PT, together, we wanted Spooky Kojima. We wanted some Spooky Kojima. It, it, it just took us 10 years. Yes. Wait, did they actually confirm oh, Death Stranding 2? Yeah. You loved it. I did, I? Yeah, you said, I love this. Oh, damn. And you said, I will never forget this moment. I love it. I did say that. Now I, you know what? Now I remember. Damn. That's <laughs> crazy how I remember that. Like, I'm really down because, dude, like, Peel's movies are freaking super sick, yeah. super original. I need to see the rest of them. I, I loved it. Uh, you really went up. What's it called? <laughs> nope. Up and nope. That's where people went. It went up. They went up and nope. nope. Well, Jordan is one of those genius, and I've been a big fan of him. And when I met him, Jeff, look at that! All the Steam decks that are going away. He's like, "Can we get on?" There goes another one. We like things that we both like, and we're really happy, and we wanted to collaborate something. And and this was a big Microsoft money moment. Jordan, I grew up watching movies, and I'm a game creator now. Jordan grew up playing games, and he's a movie an Xbox. So this two yeah, collaboration will be The next box should walk through the door next. I wanted to and you know what's funny? <laughs> I, I, watched, <laughs> I watched his movies late. And I watched some of his movies on the plane. I'm like, God damn it. Why did it take me so long to watch some of these movies? You're ruthless, thank you. You should start playing the music. Nah, Kojima gets 45 minutes. He gets 45 minutes. No, the thing is, he's, uh, he gets 45 minutes out of it. He's flexing right now. Like they, they announced Death Stranding 1 at like yeah. a Game Awards thing that Jeff did. It was like in the summer. He is, he is flexing. Before this was big. There's no way he's going to like play the music on his flex. I know, I know. So, uh, what I could say right he's now is that now. I'm kind of, um, um, it's not just Jordan. I have other uh, creative collaborative partners yep. uh, with me on Guillermo board on this project. I can't really uh, say Guillermo. who they are right now, but they, I tell you, they are the legends and they're going to be amazing. I put $100 and, uh, dollars I actually there actually Yeah, Guillermo and him The more. Avengers. Yeah. I hope Junji Ito comes back. Whoa, oh, oh, damn. So that would be sick. Imagine he's, how he's over a quarter like just icons, like heel. What this man is Jeez. doing here is unlike any other game. It is going to be crazy. That's, that's it. That's sick. We okay. cannot wait to learn more. All Hideo right. Kojima, Jordan Peele, thank you so much, guys. Man, like it's it's, it's just a wild All man. Right. Like it's time for another game announcement. This one, this sixty-five right million years in the making. A billion years. Sixty-five civilization years. Civilization five. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, Jurassic Park. Really spectacular. Spared no expense. For this place, I wanted to show them something that wasn't an illusion. Something that was real. This is a very well realized CG trailer. Made by Capcom. Can anyone hear me? <laughs> that would be fucking wild. <laughs> Jurassic Park made by Capcom. If my Capcom logo showed up, I'd, what would I'd you probably do? I'd shit a chicken. A shit a chicken? <laughs> Alright, you're gonna have to go over there and then <laughs> and then Jorge is gonna have to like CGI oh, a chicken. Dude, there is this is just survival horror. 
Jurassic oh. Park? Is that what they're setting up here? Yeah, but Maybe. Like, why are they like repeating shots? So just, just, just to reiterate the fact this is Jurassic Park 1. Dead by Daylight. It's the only good Jurassic Park. Oh. I disagree. That's smart. Go in there. It's a Anyone unique there? system. Where? Uh, but that, uh, see, Dead by Daylight wouldn't have this guy as well. They're definitely setting up for Jurassic Park Survival Park. Right, they have to, or it's gonna be like a yeah, a DVD crossover. Oh. That iconic shot. You know how they did that with? A guitar wire. Yep. 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 Yeah, they couldn't get it any they other way. Couldn't get it any other way. I just like had a guitar under the thing and stopped it. Nope, they did a perfect though. How does it work against them? What the hell? Remember it distracts him? Florida. As long as it's not Jurassic World. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Hey! Okay, that sounds it's cool. Just stress work survival. Nice. Oh. Yeah, that sounds cool. No in game though, huh? That was in game. A little bit. Of had a little bit. It was yeah. early. Yeah. But it's like Very Jurassic Park, you know, survival horror. Yeah. Official yeah. though. It's, oh, uh, it's sparkling. It's, it's when we got Dino Crisis at home. I told chat last night, you're not getting a Dino Crisis, you got it. It's not <laughs> ExoPrimal. Yeah. Literally got it. There you go. Damn, did we even Audio play design. it past the beta? Sound is an I didn't. Overlooked, Jeez. But crucial aspect of game development. No, this is not I important. Never, this is not important. Yeah. 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 This is not important. We're talking about sound. Not this year. Sparkling. Damn. The echoes inside an abandoned spacecraft are you talking about or the uh, satisfying design. sound yeah. of shooting a Which weapon. is important. I think his shirt is I mean, no, no, we don't need that. I was hella important for Lethal Company. Of audio design and games. Yeah. It's not, it's not here, but Lethal Company literally has the best the proximity chat in possible. any game ever. Oh, yeah. Here are the nominees. Best audio design. Oh, this is Alamite 2 is winning this. Probably. Yeah. Even though it should go to Hi-Fi Rush. You probably should go to. I think Hyper Rush has an outside shot. Hyper Rush is yeah. getting a lot of oh, nominations, though. It's that's, getting that's a lot of noms, noms but Hyper Rush uh, should win this because audio. I think you might have actually seen all of them. There might be one other one. Hyper Rush audio design is pretty great. The soundtrack is also my favorite. That bike. Give it to Hi Fi, man. Going that, down. Yeah. Yeah. This one to Alan White. Hi Fi Rush. Hey! Let's go! Hey! Oh, damn, let's go! Oh, 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 Balance all of a sudden. Robocop is Robo very happy. Yeah. I'm happy because I was like, it's Hell yeah. like this yeah. might have an outside shot because of the whole beat system. Yeah, look at this that. was the one that I was hoping was going to take it because it's like, it's, high five brushes are some needed audio. something. Right. Yeah. Uh, thank you so much. I don't believe it. this is their first win, huh? Who's shaking? Is that? Probably gonna be their own. Ah. Messed up. But they did a good job. Right, See, this is the thing. You get, you get sound design and then already, you have Chelsea. soundtrack. Right. So it's Island like, they're different. Fortnite. Yeah, they're, they're very different. Updated with yeah. new trophies tonight to collect. Fortnite is expanding into a full on platform with what tons of new experiences beyond Battle Royale. Earlier today, Lego Fortnite launched, and on Saturday, oh, the music game Fortnite Festival. Tomorrow, though, the team at Sion is doing it. We're going to do it. Look at him do it. Take a picture. Oh, you can't even be a normie over here. Picture. Shut up, ho. Give me a little picture. Free Fortnite stuff? I'll take it. What, Nord? Ooh, the race game. Hot Wheels. Will this get you in? Split second like racing? If it had it. It's so funny. 
during the Eminem concert, they promoted this, this and the freaking Legos. Yeah. Oh, they man. did all that stuff. And I'm like, is am I gonna see a concert or am I gonna see your promotions? They're like, yeah, you know, we'll, we'll give you five, like, it just looks like San Francisco Rush. <laughs> we'll give yeah. you five minutes of actual Look Eminem. And Crazy the rest will just be that's promotion. Trying to kill you. Well, this is not actually game. Any, what do you think? I'm in it. Bro, I already like Fortnite and I like racing, so yeah. I'm fucking in. I mean, if Fortnite gets like an arcade racer mode, that's pretty sick. Yes. Depends on how the controls feel. Holy shit. That's Dude, Fortnite's got the money, bro. Yes, it has the money, but that doesn't necessarily mean like, well, oh well, look at Red Dead too. Because they're teaming up with Rocket Racing. Rocket Racing, wow. I'm in it. That's Not crazy. actual gameplay footage. So yeah, no. Yeah. But it's still. It's, it's, it's going gonna, gonna to depend on So the, it's a thing in Fortnite. Simmons, wait, 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 there is an wait, extremely wait, high wait. chance. I'll play tomorrow. Wait. That'll play good. Very high chance. Fame still holds sway. That Black Wukong game? Their glory fades to time. Oh, I thought he was wearing a mask. I think so. Master, are there more good folks in the world or bad? More good. Of course. Then why is there always suffering? And why do the bad folks always win? Because goodness without teeth punishes not. It Ugh. only foments evil. Whoa. Hey, you're talking about right? Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, Black Metal Kong. Here, uh, that you gotta play this. That is your destiny. Wow. Hi, the yeah. keeper of the new I wonder West. If I, I wonder Welcome my child to play this. Destined Full translation one. in this trailer, the too. The destined one Voice acting doesn't everything. even know what he's destined for. Wow. No, it's funny, I know this because you ever watch so much Lego Monkey King? I'm talking about small Lego. I'm destined for extermination! You're driven by glory, not destiny. So this is the face of the destined one. It will fit me just as well. Bathed in blood, yet preaching peace. Oh, you are more to enlighten me. What justifies your superiority? Looks like it'll play like Elden Ring type shit. Maybe more DMC like? Maybe? Hard to tell, man. It's just been so long since we've actually seen like. Holy hell! A big cohesive stuff on this game. Summer of Five, right? Yeah, I believe so. It's a very ambitious project, man. Oh, yeah. I thought it was in development hell, or just like, yeah. It kind of is, to be yeah. honest. Also, maybe I'm gonna But at the end of this, we're probably getting a release date. Mm. Or at least a, a release year. A release year. What do you think, Max? 2025, 2026? I think it's 2025. Oh, sweet destiny. Nope. Wow. Oh, Damn! Even no earlier! Way. There you go. No way. One month's off. That's getting pushed back. 2024 is kind of empty. Start, start putting... Uh, That's going to get pushed back. Start putting your flags down. Stake your claim. Oh, uh, Justice League. The Flash. Suicide Squad the killed the Justice League. Your friends are slaughtering the people they swore to protect. Oh, they... They just showed a whole bunch of this. The game's coming out in February. Yeah, it looks a lot different now. <laughs> Who was it? Was just kind of like... The not coming out for a long, long time. It was Nico or someone. The game's not coming out anytime soon. I'm like, yeah. that is... Yeah, <laughs> Nico all wrong. <laughs> Later, I mean, whole was last year. Was it Nico out? Be Might have been out. Long. I don't remember. But I was just kind of like, no, oh, dude, this game's coming out soon. So now it looks more like a real game. Than I'm yeah, I was trying to figure out what was everybody so upset about when it first came. Like, yeah, it was the gameplay looked boring. Yeah. It did? And yeah, it was revealed that it was essentially like, at some point it was said that it's a games as a service game. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, life service. Everybody was like, fucking Christ. Especially after Marvel, they did not want one, another one of those. Yeah, yeah. After, after Avengers. Yeah, yeah Avengers. Uh, I also heard that um, this was changed from the original project. It was supposed to be a Superman game. It was supposed to be a live action Superman game, but they changed it into Suicide Squad. That's. That's missed. That's not true. Rock City was never doing the Superman project. Uh, 
uh, Montreal one. You guys made Arkham Knight. Arkham Knights. Right, right, yeah. That's Arkham a Arkham different Arkham. developer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They are going to work. They didn't happen. Yeah, they didn't happen. UCA land. Wow. That's a good time to release a game. Nothing Holy else, nothing else coming out right nothing now. Nothing else coming out in February, you know? Suicide On my birthday. Squad. Joining me now are Rebecca and Megan from Digital Extremes up in Canada to gloves. talk about all things Warframe. Jesus. Uh, we've got a special Warframe Twitch yeah, drop. Yeah, time. Oh, man, that's, that's, uh, that's, that's Black Panther. We've also got some Black Panther. That's a uh, Damn, bro. Black Hat. Yeah, we do. You know, it's been 10 years for Warframe, so, you know, 10 years for you. We assumed we'd get a senior's discount of some time just because our game is probably the oldest game well. here, maybe. But, yeah, we it's have... It's going strong. I know. It's because our community is so awesome and we are going to be showing you the release date for our next major update for warframe so we do have a trailer yeah, warframe, so for going strong. warframe players around the world to watch Wasn't it like one of the exciting. first big successes yeah i mean it's been yeah. an incredible yeah. ride 10 it's years of just ago. our incredible 20, developers our community years, just supporting us along the way so if you're a warframe fan and watching we love you and thank you so much and i hope you enjoy the next update whispers in the walls oh yeah thanks for having us back to devs at home we love you guys all right thanks guys let's take a look <laughs> this guy's afraid of her hands really? he's trying to back away Hey, yeah, he was like, ah, okay, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> he was scared. No call to wake you. But now, you have changed everything. The lidless eye has seen you. The Tenno. So it's a new Warframe? No, it's an update. Ah, okay. A very old game. Yeah, but it's sick as fuck. Yeah, people still love it. Well, it made a lot of money. Yeah, it did. It was very successful, too. It was yeah. like that old Sega game. Remember that Sega game where you ran and sit on your knees and run around? Vanquish. Yeah, Vanquish. To me, it just seemed like they just took Vanquish and made it into like a crazy cool game. Right? Yeah, see? Vanquish. But even if we're in the granddaddy of gas. Yeah. It was slide shoot the game. Oh, yeah. Strafing. That's really what it was. Oh, you know, I actually played it for a little bit and I never finished it. I never even got to like I mean, any of it. My ass is still hanging on that Sega trailer, dude. Holy yeah. shit, Sega is like that. And that's what it yeah. was. It was like. Oh, it was, I'm almost in disbelief. Like, yeah. Like, it, like, it's not like, oh, we'll, we'll think, we're going to think about doing like one. No, you know, no, it's like a declaration that we are changing our company mantra. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're going back to the shit that you love so much because we've obviously strayed. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Obviously, our company became one thing over those years. We didn't yeah. know what the hell we were. Now it's like we're becoming global again. Yeah. You know what? All that time they spent, like you know, giving so out their IP and stuff like that, they probably used the money to the rebuild. Them. Well, they probably got enough nope, good positive buzz from it. Yeah. Like, yeah. We probably expect House of the Dead to come back. Probably looking at that one like, oh, there is an audience. Yes. Dude, there is a future repentance. There is an audience. Repentance of Dragoon. Right. Like that could happen. Well, the entire time the company's been afloat by just giving out their IP to other people, right? started with like the Sega Cinematic Universe. Remember the Sega Cinematic and then you see all the IPs and stuff like bit. that? I mean, that was, oh. just, that was just some artists. It, it, it almost makes me wonder if the reason why we haven't heard from Forever Entertainment about House of the Dead 2 and we haven't heard from them about Panzer Dragoon, maybe they just got far on board. You gonna try to win, Chad? Maybe they just got on boarded. Like, what, what was, what has Sega, like, honestly been, like, what has been their main Dude, source it's of Dude, literally Sonic and Yakuza yeah. for, like, yeah. the past now, eight years. Universal yeah. Studios and before that, it was, like, Hatsune Miku stuff, you know, and things like that That still that. is a thing out, or out there in Japan. Mobile, but... To a degree. And Fantasy Star Online, too, you know. Yeah, like, PSO does make kind of just the background. Like, being like, hey, Sega isn't just those things anymore. Sega is... Freezer Rage, Jet Set Radio, big budget games like uh, Crazy Taxi, Jesus, Golden Axe, what the hell else was in there? Shinobi. Shinobi. Cool ass TV. Holy crap, dude. Shinobi. And I more. Like I can't believe they upgraded uh, Crazy Taxi. That's I, like I, love my We have to go back and look at it because chat was saying, Chick Max, there's multiplayer stuff in Crazy Taxi. Yeah, there was. Oh, oh my god. god. Like yeah, oh my god, like bro. Cops and robbers, oh yeah. my god, bro. I can't wait. They're going to make it open world. And <laughs> Kenny's gonna be so angry. Ooh, no, I'd be it happy. might be like we're not paradise. Yeah, you imagine it already was world? that though. Crazy Taxi already was that. It wasn't. Imagine like two players and like you have to get to the you have to get to the fair first it or looked, something like that. It looked like there were three taxis doing their thing, and one guy was a cop trying to get to the taxi. Yeah. Mm. 
We have so you can play the cops and taxis. From the lingering dead. That'd be kind of interesting. Keep the Maybe like try to stop the taxi from making it to its uh, destination. Yeah. <laughs> kind of interesting. On Adam's souls. We see what's there like grip on this world. This is shown like last year. Is broken. Was that or last summer or something? I vaguely remember this. Life to the living. Death to the dead. Life to the, to the living. Death to the, to the dead. dead. Life to the living, death to the dead, honoring my oath, or sacrificing the living to bring me back. I'm not sure I can do this. Honor your oath, or bring me back. But don't leave me like this. Looks extremely high budget. Extremely. Oh, February 13th. Yeah, it's it's, 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 time to release it's, hey, it's not Bioshock. I, I need the police. You need oh, the police right away. I'm sorry. Is it the Jack for the Indian? No. You ready? Hog! Back down! Right is down! Hog! We got you! Oh, no. We got to get you up! Look out! Ready? Officer's oh, down and we need backup! Let's go! So I can still make it out of this. Drop the gun so and let calm. her go. I'm not no. going in. <laughs> like, no. Come on, extraction, you know. So, are you ready? Ready or not? Yeah. That's the team that made SOCOM Void Interactive, Steve? Yeah. yeah. It's definitely SOCOM 4. Yes. Yeah. Definitely there. We have still come at home. I will absolutely forget about this game by the time it comes out. Damn. He does really test. Damn. Age of Empires, Call of Duty Warzone Mobile, Little Nightmares, and Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six are just some of the big titles coming to mobile in 2024. Head to the Game Awards on Twitch to vote for which title you want to win Google Play's own Play More Award. Now, please welcome last year's winner of Games for Impact for the game As Dusk Falls, which is coming to PlayStation on March 7th and is available for pre-order tonight. Not one something has come true Creative director <laughs> Caroline Marshall. Uh, not a Chet single. Starving, not bro. a single. Chat is starving. Chet is Where starving. Are we? Holy crap. I thought I was being generous, like getting a, a lot of opportunities here. Ed is coming. Not one gift something has happened. Sorry, I want to see Ed. Winning last year was definitely a highlight of my 22 years in the industry. Yo, Jet Games Force, for thank Impact you. is one of the most important categories at the Game Awards. The games nominated this year offer unique and nuanced perspectives on topics that concern us all, from the climate well, crisis to cultural <laughs> diversity. They Do we really? Our no horizons, way. Foster empathy and connect us as Everybody looks at their phone there. Everybody looks at their phones. Everybody looks at their phones. It's a half hour left. It doesn't end at eight. Here are the outstanding nominees. Games for Impact. Legends says a traveler will reunite the people. Mm, what's the theme? I'm playing it. Steve's like, yeah, that's his favorite game. Oh, shit. Got a whole this is the dinosaur thing, yeah. I play this. Chow. I beat Chia. Chia? I don't think it's gonna like, win. Oh this, oh, this game's gonna win. Look at that cooking. Oh, this game's gonna win. I have no idea on this one. That cooking game. Chia, I'm gonna say the dinosaur one. And the game of world goes to. Chia! Yeah! Chia! Chia! Why is he accepting it? Where's the Where's the people from New Caledonia? Waterman, thank you. All right, as soon as he starts talking, play the music. Thank you. He's not Kojima. I accept this award on behalf of uh, Develop Power Sev, who cannot be here, but I got a message from Phil Crifo, co-founder of Our Sev. I'd like to thank our self family for your trust and unbelievable talent. Kepler and Sony for believing in this crazy project. Pretty much learning and English because the entire like population of New Caledonia. Yeah, it, it was the first game from, the, from that country. And the crazy thing was, like, 
it's Thank this you, big ambitious you... game mm -hmm. and like 10 people made it yeah but it's like a, a big like wind waker yeah, Zelda that's, size yeah, that's, game yeah. like it's just kind of like insane hello I'm Abu Bakr Salim. I'm mainly known for my acting work in Raised by Wolves and Assassin's Creed Origins. Mm. Never played any of them. But, but, yeah, Raised but by Wolves is that is up. not why Raised I'm here. Wolves. Yep. Oh, you haven't okay. seen that show? Yep. Sorry, no, this is, this is crazy, like space man. space show where it's like mother and father. Yep. I mean, I, I remember watching the Game Awards when I, I was younger. Holy you know, yeah, crap, like, that oh, is oh, him. Oh, oh, god damn it. Ah. That show's canceled. Yeah, do I get an apology? Yeah, no, you don't. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so, what are you saying, Reggie? All my life. Uh, I, I mean, I played them all my life, Raised man. Raised by Wolves is a TV Kingdom show. Hearts, Gary's Mod. No, but he Mod. said something about Reggie. We were talking. Golden really Sun. Hey, Golden Sun? And it, it, it started with my dad, right? He got me into them. If he said Bloodborne, that would have been 500 gift subs. An art form. You know, it's Did a great space to enjoy and escape did. from the reality He's just saying games you like. <laughs> he passed away a while back. He's throwing like, stuff out. He was. That's he's what he was Oro. doing. He's Oro. He can't even present with two hands. Because if he did, it would be I so epic. That I needed to try and he can only present with one hand. In a way that felt true to me and him. So I took the biggest risks of my life. And through everything that I had in making a game, a piece of art that honored him. Wait, he's making a game? An ode to the people we yes, have loved really. and lost. <sighs> so. Mm. Little more, thank you. So the reason I'm here tonight is because with the love and support of a lot of people here, I'm gonna take another big risk and I'm gonna show you what we've been building. No, I'm gonna offer you this game. A game from my old man. I hope you like it. Damn, okay. Stop crying. Everybody stop crying. Holy crap. I just... Everybody stop crying. Lost. Every story oh, it here? begins at the end of another. Each story carries with it the echoes of those that came before. My baba, my father. Oh. Your story was snatched away too soon. My name is Zao. That's fucking Shaman cool. Here. I seek my father's return. Holy shit. Yo, okay. Okay. Very cool. Yo. Metroidvania. It was a lot like, yeah, it's just like that Prince of Persia. Pretty much like Prince of Persia again. Hell yeah. Oh, he froze the floor so he can like spin on it. Okay. Like Ori-ish. This looks good. This looks fucking great. Yeah. I think an Ori is a Metroidvania. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Did you guide me? Damn. Definitely oh, that's Metroid Vania. Yeah. It's funny because it looks so like stylistically similar to the Prince game. Kalunga, right? God of death, hear my plea. Kalunga, God of Death, come to me. Okay. Show me you are ready. Okay, dude. Oh, great. Right, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's absurd. Yeah. It's Very like, nice. Yeah. Jesus yeah. Christ. I just, yeah. Damn. Nice independent project, dude. Give it to me. Where did it go? Good. I Life is Strange. Oh, hey, hey, we got more Life is Strange. Oh, So, the original girl from Life is Strange is no longer there. This is all about, like, different people now. So, Life is Strange is just... Life is Strange is always an anthology. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Teen angst. The, movie, the game. I'm getting Strange Things vibes. Ranger things. Four players. We each got to play in VR. It's been 27 years, y'all. Why now? Because we made a promise. Oh, it's a DLC? 
Rage. No, you know what it is? It's uh, um, it? It's like it. That was lost. No, I'm serious. Like it is like yeah, the time skip. Yeah, the time skip. Bitch. Bitch. Shut the hell up. Shut up, Max. Yeah. Yeah. See? Even uh, uh, Flame said it. It. Yeah. Fuck all y'all. What'd you say? That? Between cartoon 3D graphics. I tell the truth sometimes. Wait. This is the first Berserker. Berserker. Berserker claw. DNF? DNF universe. What the fuck? What the hell? Right? <laughs> oh, this is the other stuff that they're working on DNF-wise that wasn't like DNF Duel, like the multi-project stuff. Trampled by the one you trusted. Project Barbecue? Oh. From your king. No. Different game. <laughs> it's DNF with a budget. That's hilarious. This is Ghost Blade. Yeah, it is. I mean, the story just about him. And this is Project Barbecue, and it looks fucking crazy. Damn. This is the Money Ghost. What? You have to rescue That's cool. It's like a. I like the. Um, definitely a sick ass style. God damn. Art style is. Is it like a Berserker variation chat? All these devs all up on that, all up on that Berserk game, but never actually making an actual Berserk game. That's just a class, right? Oh, nice parry. The first Berserker, okay. Uh -huh. Yeah, because it's like you have the Berserker class and all these crazy right, variants. Now it's time for our GMF first souls. performance by the Game Awards Orchestra. I'm cool. This one, though, is a little bit of a twist. They're about to play music from an upcoming game that no one has heard yet. You might call it one of those world premieres, and this is a special one. It's written by one of the greatest video game composers of all time, the legendary Nobuo Utamatsu. Damn, this is new. This is a Gordon. Yeah, make Gordon. Come on, what's your Matsu doing? Debuting the theme song from Final Fantasy VII. Rebirth. Rebirth. Enjoy. Let's go. God damn, let's go. Pizza's here. It's the golden saucer shit. Yeah. It's the golden saucer play. If the dog could be quiet, that'd be great. That was more barking. Bark, 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 yes. The yeah, the dating thing is definitely there. You want the door or no? I'll get it. I'm not moving. Okay. <laughs> hell yeah! Hell yeah! Whoa, bro, that was them taking off. That was them taking off. I mean, that's gonna be there. Zach and Eris? She's singing. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. Like, was that her thing? No, no, it's no. a part in the game. Mm. There's uh, there's some crazy spoilers going on in that trailer, boys. Damn. There's some crazy spoilers. That might be way too much. They allow it. I'm, I'm debating looking at it again. They allow I'm it. Debating it, dude. They literally showed Rocket. They showed Rocket Town. They showed Sid taking off. We knew that was gonna happen, right? Well, it also means that we're gonna hear him. Yeah. A situation where do we just do we just go completely it dark? Was always, it was always a gamble. Yeah, it was always a gamble. How much did you get spoiled? I don't. I actually didn't. Like the only thing that registered in my head was yeah. just like I saw Aerith and Zach, I saw Vincent, and there was Sid. That's all I got. Sid taken off. Mm -hmm. That was it. Man, look at the stage. You got a 
pretty decent look at you know at his character model. Right? Don't worry, there'll be like fifteen thousand people uh, posting this on Twitter after this. Is so yeah, I know, right? You gonna get hit? Man, that smoke's going everywhere. What an absolutely beautiful song from Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, which is nominated for most anticipated game tonight. Thank you to Lauren Allred and Maestro win, Lauren yeah. Bowles and the Game Awards Orchestra. They will be back. Is it an award for that? Later to pay yes. Most most to game game next year. It's a weird award. Yeah, it's a really but strange that's award, not right? All we have tonight. It's like who's popular award? Final Fantasy. The fuck? What? Oh, 16 uh, DLC. What we've done that set in stone, or so they'll tell you, Deity, because the future has the power to change anything, even the past. Strap in, Newty. Things are about to get wow. mighty interesting. Fuck you! Apex. <laughs> oh, fuck. oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh <laughs> fuck! Is it fucking happening, bro? Where is he, though? <laughs> right. No. Oh, Apex! Apex! Yeah. Oh! Very fun when limits are made to be broken. When Final Fantasy VII Rebirth comes to Apex Games. Oh, Apex Max is oh, never playing oh, Fortnite. Oh, 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 it's been confirmed, chat. Nomura-san himself, thank you so Max much. Max is that. never playing Fortnite. But they didn't have now the characters. This is sword. Of a few more awards as selected by the fans. Dodge the bullet there. <laughs> the category of best Play sport Apex, music. fucker. No, uh, Apex it is. Two, Baldur's Gate Three. Best score music. Final High five. Come on. 16. Hi-Fi Rush, High five. Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. High five. And the Game Award goes to... I was about to hug all my friends there. Final wow. Fantasy hey. 16. Hey. Yeah, that's pretty great. I told you, 16 was winning. I was about to have a group Tears hug with all my Fortnite-loving friends yeah. over here, yeah. and that didn't happen. Dave the Diver, Dredge, Dave the Diver. Sea of Stars, Ooh, Dave and Dave's gonna get it. Dave is gonna get it. Stars one. goes no. to... No, I'm dead. Sea of Stars. Whoa! Yeah, you're wrong. I was wrong! Right. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Cyberpunk. Destiny 2. Cyberpunk. Happy to be wrong there. Two. It's Cyberpunk. Destiny 2. Destiny 2. And No Man's Sky. Oh. And the Game Award goes to Baldur's Gate 3. Wow. wow. All right. right. You need any support of that right. game? Nominees for Best Fighting Game. Nickelodeon All-Star. A lot of wrong. wrong. If it's anything other than Street Fighter 6, it's, it's, it's a mind blow. I'm about to trash this whole thing. And Street Fighter 6. Gotta be Street Fighter. And the Game Award know. this year goes to... Street Fighter 6. Street Fighter 6. There you go. There you go. Uh, uh, mandatory. It's right. mandatory. Most anticipated game. Your yeah. nominees uh, of all those, it's Rebirth, bro. Come on. Rebirth. Hades 2. Like a dragon, infinite say Tekken. wealth. I want you to say Tekken. Star Wars Outlaws. I need you to say Tekken. Tekken, eight. Tekken, eight. Tekken, eight. Tekken, eight. Tekken 8. Say it. This year goes to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. <laughs> That's fan voted. <laughs> That's fan voted, yeah. All right. Well, it's been eight months since the release of Honkai Star Rail, a winner tonight for best mobile game. This space fantasy RPG filled with myths and legends is set for more intergalactic expeditions in 2024. And tonight, we have an exclusive look at Penacone, the next destination. They kind of look cool, but like there's shadows in front of like the rest of the, the crowd that's being illuminated. Mm -hmm. That's kind of cool. Do you still remember it? Nice aesthetic. So what do we have to review it's after this? We got the, the FF7 trailer, potentially. Oh, Sega. Chat, chat, chat will give us an update. Sega, that's Sega. FF7. Sega for sure. What was? It's pages Are you gonna look at all the FF7 stuff? If, I'm gonna wait on chat's interpretation if it's like, you're, you're good. Like this is mostly stuff we know about. Did you close your eyes? No, I mean, I saw it. I just didn't, I can't interpret any of it <laughs> until you see it again. Dude. Like, I'm gonna ask you what just happened to that character a second ago. He got jumped on. Uh, before that. Uh, what happened before that? Uh, he got a little ball and he crunched uh, it. Yeah, no, that did not happen just a second ago. Yeah, it actually was a second ago. Yep. This is Al Zero game. Yeah. And the book page is turned, and now it's another page. And it turns the white page. This is what? Why um, didn't anyone get to come up and, and accept, the award, accept the award for, for best soundtrack? Why was it just rattled off with like five other awards? Please, trailers. We're watching trailers. Mm. <laughs> they did it last year. Simmons, we're watching trailers. It's Genshin. Yes, if you're not. What do you want the award show just to be about awards? I guess if you're not personally friends with you know the composer, you don't get to go up. And so and we just we Simmons, trailers. trailers. I'm looking we at just have to wait shit. for mm. Terry Bogart to show up in mm. Final Fantasy and in, uh, in Fortnite, I guess. Wow, look yeah, at that. Terry, oh, Terry, the last hope now for you in Fortnite. That yes. logo. You just gotta like, get Strider in there. You have Rock Howard in there. That logo Strider. looked like freaking girl, Final Fantasy. The Galaxy Ranger.
A nominee tonight for best mobile game, Monster Hunter Now is the new mobile game from Niantic and Capcom. Like all of Niantic's games, Monster oh, Hunter Now is played in the real on. world, and Thank tonight you know, they yes. have a special in-game event going on right now with new monsters, new weapons, and special free game items for new players to join the hunt. It's available now for iPhone and Android, so check it out, Monster Hunter Now. Coming up, we've got an exclusive new look at the new Fallout series. We'll be right back. Oh, they're probably gonna show off the movie. It's been out for a while. Yeah, Monster Hunter Now's been out for oh, quite a long time. Uh, what Fortnite's too big for Final Fantasy VII. That's what I got out of it. Fortnite's got Legos and shit. Mm -hmm. And racing. I don't worry about no lo small ass game like Final no, Fantasy. No, 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 then I don't care about the most anticipated game yeah. in 2024. Small ass game. That's the shot I saw. I know, I know. But it was, it was all like over Twitter. Twitter. Black. It was all over Twitter. I was making fun of it. Yeah, because like some some companies aren't in our pod. Like on Muffin Man's fucking Disney's hands right now. Does Muffin Man really love Call of Duty? I don't know. It's a Why do you think he it's does? It's a love hate relationship. You know, like Masochist. I will say, I played more Modern Warfare 3 multiplayer of any Call of Duty multiplayer uh, since Vanguard. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. No. I, love, I like Vanguard. It was just throwing a random MOP song. Sure, whatever. Oh, yeah, no, that, that was that was decided upon. That's yeah. it. Dark Rifts. When are you going to play Zombies, Max? Zombies? Yep. Uh, I haven't played Call of Duty Zombies since uh, World of War. Jeez. Me neither. Yep. Man, that's kind of cool, though, that weapon. Yep. A lot of crazy stuff with zombies. I'm not done yet. Yeah. I did zombies once just to <laughs> No, don't do this to people. Don't do this to people, Ubisoft. Don't do this to people. Uh, what? Why? Why? No, you're, no, it's not. Come on, dude. Are we sure? Are you sure this time? No, it's not. The ocean together. Oh, why three? Why three? Are we sure? I'm like, why three? Well, yeah, people don't have four friends. Yeah, straight out of Pirates of the Caribbean. Jeez, this is good. Yeah. It's a big budget. Alright, friends, one of us is gonna have to sit out. It'll be me, don't worry. Damn. You don't wanna play this? I'm not a pirate guy. Steve's into Pilates, not pirates. Exactly. Yeah. Steve's no longer a pirate guy ever since we threw him on the brink. Nah. That sucked this shit. Adorable. No, it's not. Skull and bone. Are we sure? That game, it, it, it should have said February 16, 2014. All right, we're back here at the Game Awards, and that was a new look at Skull and Bones from Ubisoft, which is coming out on February 16th. I'm happy to announce that players can register now for the upcoming closed beta from December 15th to 18th on real. all platforms. And now it's time for Ooh, the announcement of the next game like from the studio week. that won Best Game Direction in 2021. Dude, you remember that? I don't know. Bug Bethesda! Huh? Death loop. Oh, it's Death Loop. It's gonna be Dishonored 3! Never mind! Yeah. Damn. Death Loop. Uh, Loop Death. Mm. Mm. Attention, the sun is currently dead. All citizens are required to shelter in the dorm. There's a new team in the game. Turn that shit up. Moving like Fortnite players. Barber, the game. Oh, oh, that's right. It's different. Relax, man. I don't bite. Oh, he's a vampire or some shit. Simmons, yeah. don't play with me. Let's go. Lock up tight now. <laughs> no fucking way. No, no, no fucking way. 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 No fucking way
I'm so super happy. I, 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 I heard, I heard, well, Jeff, I saw that rumor last night. What the fuck? That's a crazy announcement. Yes, it is. I saw the rumor, went, no way. Let's see. Damn, dude, Arcane doing, so that's the guys that made Dishonored. That's perfect. It's gonna be first person then. Oh, sure. Yeah. Oh, wow. First person. I want to see my character. Yeah, I want to see Blake. Passion. You see his cool hands going like. Yeah. You see his hands doing this. I don't like, okay. Guys trying to ice skate uphill. So right. honored to announce this true Marvel team up. Yes, and uh, after Dishonored and Deathloop, our first order of business was to make another very arcane game but with a title that is easier to say in a French accent. Mm. And uh, when we had, you know, when Sebastian Miton and I had an opportunity to chat with Marvel, yeah, said, okay, jacket. let's really challenge them. Let's present our widest chest. take on a superhero that we both love. And we ate it up. Mm. I mean, the arcane touch fits Blade like his trademark trench coat. Yeah. And I mean, <laughs> think about it, it's, it's a mature action adventure game single player where you get to play Blade your way. For true believers, it's a dream come true. Yeah. Yeah. So some in -game, though? More, I think Maybe why this in -game. character? Well, he's the daywalker. Uh, Eric Brooks is half man, half vampire, torn between the warm society of the living and the rushing power of the undead. Same guys as Redfall? Uh, as no, it's a kid no. of mixed Different origins, arcane. uh, mm -hmm. his arcane's dual heritage big. resonated with me. So yes, it is a dream to be making a game the about Blade that made in Red Paris, Fall my hometown. The guys the ones that made you know, that it's... space horror game, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Prey. Well, Prey. If, it was the Prey, the Prey reboot. Yeah. <laughs> if my hometown was walled in, and we shared it with bloodthirsty invaders that come out as soon as the sun goes down, ça serait un petit peu la merde, quand même. Are we gonna game? Anything else you could tell game? us about the game? I know it's pretty early, right? Did they show over right earlier? Uh, I can oh, tell you one yeah. thing, okay? Right. Uh, the entire team at Arcane Lyon is, you know, pouring so much love into this immersive third person. Third person! Let's go! Oh, it's third person! Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Okay. Yes! Because that's the thing, they're all first person games for the most part. Yes. Yeah. Ah, okay. Merci! Wow. Hey! Jeff's like, stay! Yeah! 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 All right. I want to see Blade do his star of Twisted Metal, a nominee tonight for best oh. adaptation. Oh, so we don't That's a crazy ass announcement, dude. Yeah, yeah. That and like Wolverine next to each other with like the you know, mature action games from Marvel is kind of sick. Did they show anything Wolverine? Yeah. No, we haven't seen anything since He's the announcement. Just that teaser trailer. Oh, okay. They both had like a very similar. Thank you guys. Very very similar. Thank you. Everybody. The camera guy you almost got kicked off the stage. What happened? Hey, I uh, just want to say a big thank happened? you to Can't everyone who watched Twisted oh, Metal gotcha. on Peacock. And, hey, hey, yeah, yeah, I have one thing to do before I get on to the award. I'm I heard the show is actually pretty decent. Yeah, I heard Twisted okay? Metal is good. Yeah. Okay, all right. I know I say a lot of different things. You can't scream them all. Jeez. <laughs> now, no one knows this yet. So you three guys and everybody else is going to be the first. Second season. Because of our incredible fans. We knew. Twisted Metal is coming back for season two on Peacock. Uh, so, I watch it. so, yeah, I didn't get to move the ribbon. Yeah. Because you're going on another ride with John Doe. You look great. They were like, go ahead and announce. Right you, you guys great. look great. Mm. Keep it going, baby. I don't trust this dude, but y'all look great. All right. I so, don't you yell at me. I love you more. I love you. What is wrong with y'all? Mm. Mm. <laughs> you God. You. Yeah. Okay. You. Girl with the green hair. Why is the hair so green? I see you. <laughs> oh. Let's just point at everybody <laughs> yeah, and you. confuse okay. everybody at home. Today, no one knows what's They're happening. Confused because we can't hear the it. The best games are like living universes, constantly expanding with new content and challenges. Why he's waiting for the right? color bronco to And that's what this award. He <laughs> might be still bronco's like, please, please wait. wait. Uh, please the wait. We're trying to figure this out. To deliver Start ad living. Experiences for their loyal communities. Here are the nominees. <laughs> Best ongoing game. Ongoing. Light always. Apex. Oh my uh, god. Fortnite's winning the Max shit. Max. Oh yeah, if it's Max on there. Apex. Fortnite is winning the actually, shit. Actually, I was actually thinking Cyberpunk. Cyberpunk, Cyberpunk is for like. Boy? Yeah. Dude, it's Fortnite. But Cyberpunk like good stuff for like um 
you know. Oh yeah, one. Oh yeah, one. Oh yeah, one. Oh yeah, one. Oh yeah. But. Oh yeah. But. Media loves a comeback story. Yeah. Oh yeah. But. Oh yeah. But. Media loves a comeback story from Cyberpunk. Yeah. True, but comeback. it's Fortnite and it's unfair. Yeah. It, it's either be okay. Fortnite or Apex. I get so many cool points with my sons for this moment. Yeah. Um. All right. Fortnite, a so. Billion percent. You just said it. You said it. The Game Award goes to. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Cyberpunk 2077. There There's no so way. Let's call that I call a comeback this, story. I call so this. Call media loves a comeback story. No fucking way. So I touched the guy in the suit of armor. Yes. Dude. dude, Simmons, you're right, dude. These things are trash. Like, it's not even. It's not even like. It's. It's not even like fair. I mean, it's not fair, but it's like I you know, know it's bullshit. I know how the. I know you how the. You know it's things. bullshit. There's know, no way Fortnite can win that. Bowser from Sonic. I know how the media thinks was on these once one of them. I was once one of them. I know how they see. Super rigged, bro. They felt I, there's. Uh, this is conspiracy. Is this is just this is just me talking out my ass here, but I feel they felt that there might have been a little bit of egg on their face when they were showering Cyberpunk with all these heats in the Game of the Show awards for like multiple years. And it came out bad. Game comes out, it's terrible. Makes them look. We were the only ones. Yeah, we were the only ones. That came out like guys. Like, like, you know what, dude? After we got shitted on it. Oh, we definitely we got shitted on for for saying it didn't look that great. We went to that show. Yeah. We had a full presentation. We're like, it doesn't look that good. It looks all right, I guess. Everybody, the presentation was also boring. It was. Yeah. I fell asleep. We were falling asleep. Yeah. Best thing was Keanu. Yeah. So they were. And I think they're like, we we this made us look bad by us showering all this praise on this game. Comes out the game is like broken. Yeah, yeah. So they go back. They fix the game. They make the game what it's supposed to be. It is now the cyberpunk. It is now the cyberpunk of dreams. Thank you so yeah, yeah. Much. So now the media and the media is Thank going you. to reward that because it's rewarding the comeback. The, both them and themselves were like, we saw, we had the vision, we knew what we were talking about. So you reward guys, like, hey, you did bad, but you fixed it. That's like you're just you're ongoing what like, you're like, supposed to do. No, I agree with you, Cam. Uh, I definitely they, agree they, with you. I'm just kind of like, you're selling the product. You you're selling the finished product. Steve C. Martin is here to unveil a brand new project. Steve? Thanks, Jeff. Great to have you here. You showed it, showed this to me earlier this year. Uh, tell us a bit about it. It's an honor to be here, so thanks for having us. Over the past few years at Lightspeed LA, myself and a remarkable team of over 200 talented, diverse industry veterans and fresh extended talent have been in deep development on, Twitter. on a fully original, extended. AAA, we'll see. futuristic open world game. Tonight, we're really excited to offer you all a sneak peek at what we've been working on. I'm, I'm seriously, I'm so excited to share so much more with you in the future. But for now, I hope you all enjoy this first. It's going to be tied to a big IP or something. Let's like that, take right? a look, Steve. Here we go. It feels like it. It is. feels like it's. It feels like here's the reveal of what it is. Because it's like future open world game. Robots, though. Mommy. I'm scared, mommy. Please. Hush now. It's going, go, going to be okay. The demon is here. It's the demon. It's the demon. <laughs> Follow me. If you want to live. Just hop on my bike. Everyone get on the bike. <laughs> oh, nothing in game? 
It looked kind of cool. It does yeah. look cool. I mean, just, it was just cinematic. in terms of cinematic presentation, cinematic. this it is what we. No game this there. is an idea yeah. more. There was no game. Oh, so this is what Jeff's doing. They're like, hey, you have to show the game. You have to show what it looks like. Oh, did he say that? I, that's that's what I'm getting out of this. Is that? Oh, here we go. Oh, never mind. This isn't even that. This is Death Stranding too. Now open your eyes slowly. Or is it? <laughs> So fucking confused. Take a breath and look around you. What? This is that Korean game. This Stellar Blade? I don't know if this is that. No, no, first, uh, first. Get it together. Yeah, it's cool. yeah, the booty game. This is that Korean booty game. It's dope, though. Does look good. First I'll second. find you. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's cool. That last trailer so like bleed, bled into it this one. Like, yeah. yeah, it was like, it felt like it was looking at, dude. They didn't even say anything. That it just was, the was first there. Descendant, which is launching the summer of 2024 from Nexon. Did you even now rolling we have a new his eyes. Mario versus <laughs> next big game, Zenless Zone Zero, an urban fantasy hey. ARPG. I had my eye on this one for a while. We had it at Gamescom, and we're excited to unveil the latest budget and all right passion. here at TGA. It, like, the animation of this game is the animation was mind blowing. Yeah, I, I, I saw know. a clip just on Twitter. I was like, "What the hell?" I can tell you from playing it, it's like I don't understand how they can afford all this. Yes. <laughs> well, it's also kind of cool to see that, like, hey, we made a bunch of money, so what are we gonna do with it? Spend it. Make yeah. make more make more and cool a, stuff. And apparently, they're like. Uh, what was their name? They had some mantra, which is like, anime weebs oh, save the universe. Like, like Echo Taku saves the Save the universe. And apparently they like, everyone that works there is treated super well. Nice. Like that is like a, a thing. Where no one's overworked, but everyone just gets to execute like passion ideas. Mm -hmm. So it just looks ridiculous. That's awesome. That's how you get really cool stuff. Well, I mean, also, they don't yeah. need to. Too big. Genshin made them too big. They just make whatever the hell they want. It's a shark chick? Shark tail. Jeez. Is single player? Um, it is a gotcha action. And I, I think there's multiplayer elements to it. Well, I didn't play any of that part. The bear, the bear guy's pretty fun. So it's not it. fully done yet? No, it was in development. It was a beta. Oh, okay. That's what I played. That's, what the fuck? Another game different. that just bleeded into another game. That was so weird. Zone of Enders? It's not no. Zoe. That's funny. Mm -hmm. Super Zoe. Like, yeah, no gameplay, huh? <clears throat> oh, there's gameplay. Yeah, I was thinking of the first one. That's like multiplayer. The first trailer. Damn. It's like Star Wars Paradox. Very easy. Oh, it looks yeah. like a, almost like a With multiplayer game as machine. well. Yeah. yeah, that's crazy, man. Like, it looks like Gundam Boost as well, or Gundam vs. Boost. Well, it's like, it's it's like, it's like uh, your game Also, like Virtual Lawn. Virtual Lawn. Obviously, everything. Is this the last time we had a... Sega? Yeah, yes. this isn't Sega, though. No, yeah. It was the last time we had, like, a... a, a mech-like fighting game. Uh... Hmm. Pretty well, much the Gundam well, vs. Boost. Count Arena Fighters, not that long. Not long. Yeah, long. Arena Fighters. Count Arena Fighters. And technically, you know, uh, Armored Core 6 is a fighting game, I guess. Yeah. Like, it has, it has 1v1 multiplayer. Maybe. Like, arena fighters, I don't really But it's arena. Yeah, yeah. Right. You're talking like 2D or, you know, yeah, proper 3D. Yeah. yeah. Mecha, Mecha break. break. That's some hella, that's Mecha some hella Mecha Sega. Mecha. Sega. The latest cyber update. But we haven't told Mecha them what they're break. playing. 
like the name. Let's though. see what happens when they find out. This looks amazing. Ray tracing is beautiful. Yeah, it's super real. <laughs> what do you think is powering your game? Switch. Like a 4090? 40 series? You're actually playing on a Chromebook Plus. Wow. Streaming on GeForce Now. Oh, oh, my, God. oh my God. Oh my God. Max, Max would not fall for that. <laughs> <laughs> Max would feel that delay and be like, what the fuck is this? Uh, like, there are 12 frames of delay. There's here, the sir. delay. It's, it's Max can feel two frames of delay. And you're like, nah. There ain't no trash. way, bro. <laughs> you know what's funny? Max was part of that commercial. Got yeah, they got down. cut out. They got uh, kicked out. I was there. Like, like, yeah, get the fuck out of here. you and you can go home. Yeah, he's like, excuse me. Like, there's some delay. Can I get like a different TV? And he's like, uh, yeah, you're gonna have to leave, switch the TVs. Yeah. Sir, can you leave? Yeah. I'm gonna ask you to leave now. Chad, the reason this joke is funny because every place I go to to play games early, I have to fix their TVs. Yeah. To make the games feel better uh, every time. Yes, for the remote control. <laughs> yeah, every dev I go to, I'm like, can I have the remote control for this build? And they're like, for the TV? I'm like, yes, just the TV remote control. So I just turn off auto motion smoothing and all that shit. Yeah, like, that's in there. Thank you. I can actually control it now. <laughs> I've seen it. Thank you. <laughs> Multiple times. No, for, for real, I've done that at trade shows for years, and now it's like behind the scenes when I'm playing shit, I'm like, can you give the remote for the TV? Don't do it in an office. Oh, in an office, yeah. <laughs> and then the devs will be like, what did you change? Can you let me know so we can make it feel better for other people? I'm like, yes. Here, life. change this. Yep. My honor is my life. Vice Moray. What is your craft? My craft. Isn't there a movie for this too? Yeah. Oh yeah. Let me careful. Oh, this is the big action game. What yeah. Is like well, wild. Space Marine 2? Yeah. Big wild and looking game. If this has multiplayer, it'd be crazy to go on. September 9th. There you go. Stake your claim. Did Chad, did this have a... Get those dates out. Was this pretty much like a single character action game or did it have co-op? Okay, now we have a special surprise for you. Live and exclusively here at the Game Awards. Old, gar, old gods of Asgard. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am your host, Wallendor. And I present yeah. to you the old the gods of Asgard too. featuring the best-selling writer Alan Wake. This is Herald of Darkness. From what I gathered, you grew up nice and sheltered with mama's pretty stories and your own made up The game has stuff like this in it? There is a weird music in it. And it's very fun. I watched the video last night on it. I'm like, what yeah. is this? Because basically there was an argument being made that because it had a crazy musical sequence, it was going to win a soundtrack. Yeah. And I was like, oh yeah, maybe. I'm like, this is very fun, but how's the rest of the game's music no one can answer me? This looks odd that they're in suit and tie doing this. Like, they feel like, I feel like out of place. Yeah, I, got, I saw the, the game thing of this, and I was like, this is actually really fun and, fun and cool. Parada just said on Twitter, okay, where is VF6? Parada. Uh, where is VF6? It's obvious it's out there, bro. Parada's even teasing it now. He's having fun with it. Yeah. It is, it is crazy. Everything fun for a fighter. Not everything. Virtual ones. Here's 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 the thing though. I hate to say it like Golden Axe Crazy Taxi. It's like they're they're the well they always go to when they ever get to like the Green Pass It's kinda true. Right? So they're going back, okay, what's the games we always re-release? Mm -hmm. Jet Set Radio, Crazy Taxi, Song Adventure One, like like Fast Crazy Radio. They're always kinda like that, so like Okay, everyone's talking about Golden Axe, everyone remember Shinobi, Streets of Rage that did really well. So let's just go with what Safe is, bets. What is the most known IPs outside of Sonic Youth that we have? And that's what those games. Yeah. It's exactly. But I don't. But and then and then he said and more. Yeah, and that, more is obviously Virtual Fighter. Right. Yeah. Obviously. Obviously talking about more. Something, but like, maybe they're saving it for like a fighting game menu or something. Maybe if they're actually listening, we'll actually get PSO Classic. Yeah. Oh sh. That could happen. Who burst? Yeah. Blue Burst remake, reskin, retextured, you know. Yo, Lord Fossavon, thank you. Oh, 
I will say this because it's a stage show and you're just watching like you know, the, the camera dudes. It's way crazier in game. Yeah. Like the visuals and stuff going on is like way nuttier. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Max Payne is up there doing a big old dance and number. Probably was his idea, you know. Never thought this would be happening. I almost thought that was Shannon Sharp. <laughs> Shannon Sharp. And like when it was like just coming in, I'm like, oh, what's he gonna announce? Me mad? <laughs> what's Shannon Sharp doing here? And now he's just sitting there, Alan Wake. <laughs> like, I mean, you got I'm looking <laughs> for work to. You gotta, you gotta love uh, a game writer director who loves his game so much, like he wants to be part of a musical number. Yeah. <laughs> like. He is proud of the fact that they made this game. Oh, yeah. I mean, it seems like Alan was. This was this was not writer. this was not like you know. None of us have played a game. Yet. None of us have played no. it. I, I think I need to play it. Chad's been telling me not to play it, and I'm like, That's I need true. to play it, Chad. I just no, nobody's been asking me to play it. Why is why is there a musical number in the Damn, game? Damn, no gift It's subs weird. Yet. It's so strange. Oh, wow. It's a weird it's game. The fabulous it's... poets of the fall performing in the role of old gods of Asgard. Thank you to the band Sam Lake, Remedy Epic. Yeah, I need to play it, Chad. Everyone huh? involved to bring that performance to life, something you will only see right here on the Game Awards. Now it's time for an update on a game we announced back at TGA in 2017. Street Fighter 6. An update to a game? Oh, GTFO. Yeah, we haven't seen this for a long time. We all share update the to same a game. story, the same fate. A family of strangers. Maybe this was announced last year, right? A strange. Yeah. That, was, that was Game Awards last year. I believe so. There was, uh, yeah, there was give something for Hades, right? There was. That was in there. We have it's smaller, but. A thousand times. Whoever we were before. Hey, you know what's funny? I took away the anything give uh, Twisted Metal. Or a more specific Until Twisted Metal game. Yeah. And you were gonna be like, anything Twisted Metal. Yeah, and and I'm like, no. that was a new show. That would have yeah. been gift sub bad. Yep. I'm like, no, it has to be a game. Fuck yep. off. It has to be a game. Yeah, see, I took away those gift subs, chat. Be angry at me. Remember. I love Alan Wake too. You're not allowed to play it. <laughs> Screw this all. Joining me now is Ulf from Ten Chambers. Crazy, that was six years ago we announced uh, like GTFO. Jesus Christ. And that's the final chapter. You've got a free weekend on Steam. Game it looks fantastic. Way. But I think there's a little something more you're also working on, right? Mm. Yeah, first of all, I have to say thank you for, thank you for having me again. Of course. And uh, you delicious menu. <laughs> this suit is fucking amazing. <laughs> yeah. You like it too. Yeah. 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 Anyway, he's like, yeah. 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 And it's sort of a, a, a sci-fi the... thing that I've been... Remember last year's shot had like, the people in the background? They the, were yeah, facing it's... him while yeah. he was doing the... They were turning around. So they're turning around, yeah. so they're turn around and making weird faces. <laughs> All these people are like, so strange, bro. Right? I was just about to say... I was like, what the fuck? He's like, what the fuck? There's sign that says, do not look at him. Like, do not turn around. Because they're all just looking like... It was so awkward last last year. Bro, I was just about to say, like... What the fuck, There was a sign that says, do not look at Jeff. There was a shot earlier with the other lady. Some people looking backwards. People were like looking up to the side. Oh, that's still late. So you're on your Freddy Mercury... Yeah, Freddy Krugan. You're still now look at Jeff. Just spilling the beans about your recent Akajima Freddy Muniz. Let's continue. Huh. Alpha Force? Alpha Force. Is that a word you hate? He's just combining words in his head. <laughs> this is Bread Delta. <laughs> Bread Delta. Ah, uh, so that's how you found out about our Akajima fault. What were you looking for? A key. A key to what? Alpha key? Oh, no, no. Yes! This game is called Alpha Force. <laughs> <laughs> this game is called Alpha Force. I'm putting in a thousand gift subs. One thousand gift subs. Shake my hand. Shake my hand. A thousand gift subs. It's gonna be called Ultra Zone. <laughs> Ultra Zone. <laughs> Very great. Oh, Den of Wolves. Close. 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 That was really good. Cool. That was really good. 
<laughs> Develop my Alpha Force. Yeah, right. <laughs> alpha Force Studio. I just wanted to look cool by knowing a game before it comes out. Anyone else does. Like Simmons is like, what? Is that, you know? Play more games. Yeah. Did you get it? Hey, rebirth. You didn't rebirth. And this guy just looks like the dude from Lost Planet 3. Ooh, five. Boink. Hi. <laughs> Why does he like come out to somebody's TV? Oh, TV gaming. Bionic Commando. Mm -hmm. yeah. Seems like way too much. It was dark. almost Fortnite. Yeah, is this gonna be just cause or something like that? That'd be pretty nutty if it's just cause. This could be Alpha Force. Oh. Okay, so everyone's after him. Extraction inbound. Good to go? Easy in, easy out. That's our ride. Well, it looks multiplayer. It's a VR. 100% it's a multiplayer. Exoborn. Exoborn. Master of the Apocalypse. I'm so annoyed. Like, very, like, show us inceptional trailers. You know? I'm so like, sick of these freaking trailers that don't show us a freaking in game stuff, Thanks, man. Steve. Hey. Like, I, like, you can't tell anything. You don't know what the hell's going on unless you see the in game. Factions, I would call game, these trailers of catfish trailers. Yeah, pretty much. Dude. Catfish you with an like, idea. Please. The apocalypse. They may or may like not live up to it. it. Don't don't hit us with the kill zone stuff again, bro. Now, Show us the stuff that actually the is in there. Loki in Asgard's Wrath 2, one of the most ambitious and anticipated VR games yet. Matt VR. Mercer. Matt Mercer? Oh, I thought they were up to three. Fluff I saw trailers. some trailer on like a Twitch ad or whatever, and I was like, three? I, I don't remember one or so two. Did Mercer do anything Lego Monkey Kid? Asgard's Wrath 2. I've been Probably. working with the Sims also Vincent team and, Rebirth. and bringing Loki to life. It's just been absolutely amazing. I have to collect and, uh, all the Lego Monkey Kid. Playing too. Asgard's Wrath 2 um, as a lifelong gamer, I'm honestly blown away. Indoor. So, uh... I'm honored to be a part of this franchise. Yeah, he was Ganondorf, and, and he was about 100 pounds too light. Games, oh, damn. The studios. Like, he did his best. I think he did as good a job as he could have so, possibly done. But, like, let's enjoy the, this 120-pound man twisting this big old barrel chest of Ganondorf. I was like, you, yeah. Ooh. You're too thin, you tried. But you did good, but that's, this was just poor casting. The gods take everything from mortals. Bleed these lands dry. Oh, this is a this VR hurts. game. I'm like, yeah. what's with the visuals? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> to a certain degree, I'm like, what are we looking at? This is a VR game. <laughs> it could be. You allowed Loki it's to deceive you. Meta. Meta. Now his chaos reigns. Did it say actual game? <laughs> The universe demands a guardian. And with each possession, you will grow stronger. Ooh. Octobow. Yeah, it's a VR game. Oh, dutiful uh, guardian. Here to right your wrong. Grandstar, thank you. I'm with it. But it's probably not on PlayStation. I think it's a meta. Oh, yeah. It's like freaking Sony. Makes Honestly, it. like, I feel like VR is like hurting itself by having all these yes, exclusive Yes, uh, 100%. VR but you like, know what? Here's the thing the VR companies don't care because they're getting funded. Right. right? Yeah, so they're getting paid to make they're just getting a VR paid. Game. Like, if they well, the just, devs. I mean, but yeah. like the people, like anyone who's investing in VR, yes. I want my VR to have exclusive games. I'm like, well. Here's the thing about that. You're kind of making people pick and choose what VR headset they want rather than just having the game on everything. Yeah, like helping the cause. 
Your fate is mine. Yeah, yeah, I, so you want to go to VR? Help, help the platform yeah. grow and then start doing exclusive games. Like, you know, you right now, you don't VR have exclusive games. Yeah, yeah you're Meta doing it too early. Meta exclusive games. And then Free when you buy Meta Quest? Maybe it might, but it didn't say PlayStation. <laughs> Here's a, I, that's a game I would have to take a hell of a bunch of time mean to play. To the chaos that awaits you just outside. Apple Arcade. Hey, here's, here's, an actually, here's an actually good looking 3D Sonic. Oh, cool. Apple Arcade only. It's been an amazing year, not just for games, but for adaptations of the games we love. Right now, we have an exclusive look at the highly anticipated new series, Fallout. Oh, boy. We are all. We love Fallout. Yes. We love falling oh, and out. Now how about the yeah, the, the movie Man, trailer actually. This actor guy. Well, the movie trailer actually looked pretty solid. I don't even remember the movie trailer. Uh, it came out like a few days ago. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, there it is. Yeah. That's the movie yeah. Uh, uh. Oh, there it is. Yes. Oh, my awesome. Movie, yeah. yeah. The way they presented this was, I was like, dude, that's not actually half bad. Hey, oh, I remember seeing No Nose. I saw that guy. I'm like, who the heck is this guy? War never changes. Oh, it's a TV show? Wait, Ron Perlman needs to be saying that line. A uh, TV show? How dare you? Prime? Hey, I have Prime. Good. I don't have to pay any extra. I have Amazon Prime. From Fallout, please welcome Dang. Aaron Moten. Damn, look at that cosplay. I wonder if that's my, it's possible that, I wonder if that's my buddy. Jeez, look at that. I have a buddy who's a stilt guy. He's like one of the best stilt guys in the world. I hope you don't mind, we brought a little extra security. Or that could be Lance. Mm. Thank Lance you for having us. I'm incredibly excited for you all to see Fallout on Prime this April. But our real nice honor tonight is that we're here to hand out the award for no, best no, he's on something. Not that tall. What? Oh, this is Last of Us taking this 100%. Oh, yeah, that's what I said. It's think. without a doubt. Just give it to Last of Us. Oh, what? What is this? What is the Arrest word? that man. The bosses are here. But what? <laughs> huh. yeah, there they are. Oh! Hey. He's like, nah. Jonathan, no, Mr. Howard. Wrap it up. Good catch, buddy. <laughs> yeah, but we should probably... Yeah, you know, it's funny. I've never played the game, but I'll, yeah, I'll be down to watch the show. Okay, all right, all right, let's go. Okay, so this year, video games and film and television were bigger and better than well, ever before. The guy with way too much money was like, get me off the camera and wrap it up. <laughs> he was like, no, nope, cut it. Adaptation. I'm not sure I even agree with this award, technically, because it's like... Video game adaptations. Video game, it's, like, it's like movies aren't gonna do best, you know, adaptations. Video game, yeah, video game adaptation of a right. movie, right? Yeah. Things are not wrong. Um, oh, Super Mario got it. Dude, Super Mario dude. won. Last of Us is 100% taking it soon. You think so? I Super think Mario. Mario Super Mario. Mario Super win. Mario made a billion, bro. It did, but it didn't matter how much money it made because Last of Us. No. Nope. Super Mario, here we go. Ready. The Last of Us. Damn, Steve. I know how these people think. <laughs> we are relatively aware of how the industry sort of works. <laughs> Come on, Here comes Nolan Bushwell. It's not Whatever. a popularity contest. It's what does the media like? Yeah. It's so bad, chat. It's so bad. Are you just have not happy that me or Simmons gets it right every time? No, I'm just upset that the fact that these things are obvious. Well, here's that the they thing that we're not winning. set on. Simmons, Simmons thinks it's going to be Baldur's Gate 3. I think it might be Baldur's Gate. I think it's, uh, think it's going to be Zelda. Sure Zelda for the final game. Uh, I am leaning a bit Baldur's Gate, Gate right now Canada, after Golden Joystick. I mean, that's uh, also to our night off Good. family. This wouldn't exist without all your Because I think there will work. be dissent in the media uh, about it being- I agree. The like last of the show was amazing. It was and still great. Well. But to our last fucking community. Mario the took the, took the, uh, so the, the title and after that. We also want to thank our partners at Sony Pictures. Last of Us was amazing uh, show, amazing show. And to be real, BG3 winning would be would be really I'm, good. I'm, I'm so just, you know you. what? I'm like, I need BG3 to win. Yes. I need a studio like Larian to win this. It almost sends it like a letter to Nintendo, like, come on. <laughs> or, or everyone, really. Like, make make your games like this, please. Yeah. All footage captured on a Nintendo Switch. It doesn't look like it. Damn, damn, damn. bitch. Shut the, shut the trailer off. Farming I tools mean, in off. the ground. Damn, I didn't have a gift now. sub bed for this. That there'd be something farming it's in this. It's too show. obvious. God damn it. I didn't have a gift sub bed. That there'd be a farming thing. Son of a bitch. Sorry, Chad. Damn it. I didn't have a farming bed. Tools in the ground. 
Rose before hoes. What is your game? We have no idea. <laughs> it's everything. Palia. Free on Nintendo Switch. In Palia. Monster Hunter Now or whatever. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Monster Now. Yeah. I wonder how big this is in Japan. I think plenty of people are playing it. I mean, it's. I think it's doing well. I don't think it's like the biggest thing that they've ever had. Because it's, it's, it's got two things that Japan loves. Monster Hunter and mobile oh, yeah. phones. Yes. For sure. But I don't think it plays like a fish. No. I don't it know. doesn't have to. You know what? Just seeing that, that, younger, that trailer, or I guess the commercial, I kind of would was, like Monster Hunter to be in like a city setting. I think that'd be kind of yeah. cool. Put it into Ooh, look at that. Marvel vs. Capcom showed up in here somehow. Is that a good sub No, it wasn't. Marvel showed up in some way, like actual NBC. Hindsight is a narrative exploration game which spans the life of a woman named Mary. Is taking a core of something that Wait, happened so in narrative the exploration is keeping basically that the new and fictionalizing buzzword. the rest of it. There's another game like Whenever I someone tells me that they've cried from something that I've made, it's always country. when people cry is where I feel, yes, I want to keep doing that. I want to keep making people feel things. This is an interesting trailer. Yeah, there's the, the disc. Let's not talk about the release. Right? <laughs> That's what I was just about to say. You guys, if you're going to show off No Man's Sky, you better talk about the release and then how you guys came over that. You, you guys worked well, ahead that of that. The, uh, you know what I'm the, saying? Look, the Hollywood well, story. We, we, I mean, we, we, we can dunk on the guy, and Sean, you did lie straight up. Straight up lie. Straight up lie. Straight up lie. The day before the game came out. Yep. But there was no, there was, there was definitely some people taking that weight to personal. It's called the internet, Simmons. Are dumb. It's called the internet. Probably, like, that's the thing I'm worried about with like GTA 6 if it doesn't live up to expectations. Yeah. Like I fear for the devs. Yeah. You know what? Yeah, I mean? yeah. There's like 10,000 of them, so like you know. <laughs> 10,000 devs. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. That, the, the thing with Rockstar is that they they know quality. They're they're definitely not gonna. Like that up. collection, right? But that oh, wasn't oh, them. Oh, that wasn't them. That was yeah, just, but it was their money. It was their money. They but they didn't spend enough of it, so they could care less. It's but and I heard well, they, and, and, thing, and and I heard that they already um, fixed it. They farmed it out to a mobile dad. Yeah, they just gave it out to us like yeah, you guys work. Well, that's out. here's the thing. You that guys, you guys give them something. Source code. Yeah, it's like was, hey, you guys give them the something. That was the biggest sin of all. Like you guys give them these, something while we work on the big thing. We're this multi-billion-dollar company. We're giving it to a mobile dev. Like they right the sabotage from the start. Sky, yes. Like why would you do that? Ten years ago. You don't have enough money right to give it to a fucking Murray. tried and true Sean, dev. Uh, looks like the content keeps rolling yeah. in 2024. Also, they could have given it to anybody. <laughs> you know, Bro, Iron Galaxy well, would have just done with, yeah, better. Uh, than that. Next year is going to be a really big year for No Man's Sky. Like you said, I've been working on it for ten years now, and I still really love it. Still really enjoy it. But what people don't know is that for the last five years we've been working on something new. Uh -oh. uh, oh, another game. Yeah, something very different, something maybe more ambitious. It's a TCG. Um, you know, for... <laughs> the space training uh, card game. Here we go. <laughs> no, no, it's a fighting, back it's to a fighting game. Danger. It's a fighting Tell game. Tell us a bit about it, Sean. Uh, well, for No Man's Sky, we generated a whole universe of kind of sparse, alien-looking planets, and that wasn't easy, you know, it was hard, but there is something that's much harder that we wanted to do. Fighting game. Uh, for our new game, game. <laughs> we wanted to create an Earth. Oh, the we wanted to create um, a person. You know, something. <laughs> a digital uh, human. A digital human. That lives and breathes and eats and shit. That, that you will love, something fall in love with. <laughs> I remember something Project Milo. You know, <laughs> real mountains, not video game mountains, but mountains that are miles you will fall in love with and potentially marry. That when you climb to the top of them and look out, you can see rivers and canyons and continents, you know, you can Bro, see Bro, you oceans. are the tech, Silicon Valley like tech bro version of Peter Molyneux here. Yeah, I mean, the first- Play the music. Open world. Somebody start playing the music. Something without boundaries. Uh, and we're gonna let everyone play in it together. Mm. It's, you know, a place where people can live out their sort of- All right, don't hype it up too much, bro. You're gonna, 
Don't do it. Stop man. it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Not again. <laughs> it's really Think about your family. <laughs> Don't do this to yourself. Think about your only friends. Oh, Come on, man. You may hate you know, me, chat, but you know I'm right. Team that's working on us. There's about a dozen of us. We're actually, everyone's here. The the everyone's Cut the mic. Here. Cut uh, the mic. Stole the fuck up. Uh, we're very excited to share this. You and I have been we're, talking about this one for years. Yeah, we're we're super nervous. But uh, is there a trailer? Uh, really excited. No. If, uh, you can't well, I hope so. This is ah! game. There has to be a trailer. We'll be updating ten years from now. All right, so Game Awards 2033. <laughs> We'll be back, but no. Uh, There's no way they can just can't This is such an incredible talk. project, and I'm That's honored that we can show it up. Should we, should we right, do show it, it up? He says he's gonna show it. There we go. go. Give us something. Come on, man. Thank you, Peter Megazord. We climbed the mountain. There's a. They've learned a lot. They've oh, learned yeah. a lot over ten years of development. Now they're like veteran developers, you know. Mm -hmm. Needs a good name though. Earth. <laughs> Earth. Fire. You said light the fires. I don't think Max likes. Light the I, don't, I don't think Max I don't likes like the it. title. I, yeah, know, yeah, I didn't think Max liked the title. Cyber I can already tell. No is in both titles. Cyber Force. What did it say the game was? To show that to you, and uh, again, created by the team of Hello Games. So, uh, <laughs> would you like to play the game? No. To, uh, see games like that that show kind of the next decade of where games are going to, and hopefully TGA too. All right, now join me in welcoming to the stage actor Simu Liu. Oh, you got hurt. Oh, that was on a skiing accident. Yeah. What's up, everybody? How y'all doing tonight? Yeah. Oh, my God, there's so many. You're working hard on Shang Chi too. Right. Fuck someone real hard. <laughs> he yeah. kicked, he right, kicked someone real hard. Address the elephant in the room. Um, my foot's fine, you guys. I I did tear my Achilles. Uh, I wasn't riding a dragon. I was playing pickup basketball in Miami. Yeah. I wish I wish there were a better story to this, you guys. But the story <laughs> is this. Um, you know, as you age, as you get older, you know, <laughs> particularly as you cross the 30 threshold, <laughs> your body starts to break down. All right? Things all start truth. happening. Yeah. Uh, you know what's so funny? Like, Disney's got to be pissed, too, who, bro. Like, you're like, aging, don't you got to make these movies. Yeah, right? Um, and you give them a CG basketball. foot. You're not Anthony Mackie. Learn to appreciate the importance of stretching. All right? It's very important. Of stretching in your 30s. Um, just keeping it real at the game moments, all right? <laughs> Now, I'm, I'm here to share something that I'm, I'm really, oh, really excited about. <laughs> I recently got a nice. chance to team up with Frost Giant on their new real-time strategy game, Stormgate. Now, RTS is a genre that I was absolutely obsessed with as a kid. I love building armies. Uh, like, here we go. He's, 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 he's gone, gone again. How fast are we going to pizza pizza? Right? Get a pizza pizza in time, <laughs> run down there, get it, come back up, and then this will... Yes. This so RTS game you will... for that. Um, now, if you I mean, they still got to show it, so... ...raise on Bnet at any point over the past 10 years, that was definitely your I don't point. think there would be anything uh, that'll wow my balls. That's why I am so excited for Stormgate. Look, it's a noob strat, I understand, all right? But I loved it. Look, that's why I love Stormgate. It was made by a team of ex-StarCraft developers. Oh, this game. Yes. We saw a trailer for it. Uh, yeah, I mean, kind of like a middling CG trailer. Yeah. But it looked very StarCrafty. There was like Zerg and stuff in it, practically. Zerg. Yeah. 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 It was like fantasy things? It was like more fantasy-ish. Yeah. yeah, we were like, it looks like StarCraft. And it was like, oh, it's made by ex-StarCraft. I was like, oh, well, that makes sense. And the first reveal of a pretty badass new character who uh, I may or may not have gotten to voice. Mm. Let's have a look. You used to play RTS. Shut it off! Steve, really? Really? Shut up, Kenny, Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. He used to play StarCraft. Kenny, Kenny lies, I guess. He just, makes, he just makes things up. Kenny Why do you guys believe Why? him? Why would you say that about him? Why Kenny? do you guys believe him doing this? I'm just in the chapter of Steve's life I wasn't Good aware of. Lord, you just have to tell us about it. You guys always believe him. You guys don't learn. Steve's you like, used to play this. Why don't Steve, you guys that's, learn? That's not true. That is absolute Good Lord. You just lies. That's a lie. Why yeah, that? lie to us, Simmons? Steve's yeah, lying. Aaron. That's crazy that Kenny would lie to us. Yeah, no, he used to play that one, uh, whatever kind of game. Is it, Kenny, you're talking about Command and Conquer. Yes, Steve used to play Command and Conquer. I know exactly what the fuck Steve played. Jesus Christ, Kenny. Yeah, yeah? Yeah. You play Command and Conquer? Okay, okay. Did you play it? No. Wait, Steve, are you admitting to have played Command and Conquer? I love Command and Conquer. Oh my god, he played Command and Conquer. 
Anybody RTSs? Oh my god, he actually is an RTS player. Uses the oh RTSs. God. He probably uses a mouse and a keyboard. Oh shit! Oh, he's a fraud. He's a fraud. <laughs> See that, Chad? Yeah, power. Yeah, that was power. Me. Me. Yeah. Power. <laughs> See? This man did, what the fuck? This man did like <laughs> Command and Conquer. Jack of the Shadows, thank you. <laughs> and uh, and now like, it's time to hand out the next award. Here are the nominees for Best Action Adventure Game. Action Adventure. Mm, what, what came out? Win? Yeah, what came out? Yeah, yeah. Zelda's in here too, right? Yeah. Oh, Spider Man's getting it. No, Spider Man. Spider Man. Actually, damn. Ooh, boy. That's God a good damn, call. this year was fucking crazy. That's a good call. Sorry, guys. Never touched it. Kenny? It was fun. But is it better? No. Damn. It's good. Zelda's winning, that's something to say. Nah. Because it is it's the definition Spider -Man. of Spider Man. Spider Man. Alan Wings for an area. Spider Man. There you go. I say Zelda. Spider Man. No surprise here. Legend of Zelda, Tears of the King. Legend of Zelda. You're right, because they probably were like, Narrative Alan Wake. I think it's going to be like, yeah, Narrative Alan Wake, Action Adventure Zelda, Game of the Year, maybe Baldur's Gate 3. That's where I'm leaning now. Baldur's Gate. After this. Yeah. Because they have a Numa on stage now, right? Mm -hmm. And he's like accepting stuff, so you needed at least something. Wow. And a big award. Damn. All right, y'all are calling the. I'm calling it. I think it's going to be Baldur's Gate 3 now that this happened. Uh, game of the Year? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What did they do to Cookie? Just the voice actor. I'm so if, to if, if Zelda wins and they're just throwing the Cookie to the voice actor, everyone I'm, I'm ashamed. To create this game. Hey, what about you I shit a chicken? No, you, sh shitting a chicken comes from pure hype and excitement. That'd be like if there was like Mortal Kombat versus Guilty Gear or something yeah. like that. Ooh, that'd be crazy. Team truly, uh, uh, gave their all in yeah, you said Zelda and I might be the same. But I think I would do. Who is Zelda? It was definitely between these two. Yeah, I've seen Red, Red, Red Sentinel. The other one was a bone throwing to win the game of the year. It was just an argument between these two. Everyone's unique approach to playing this game uh, can become their own personal story uh, as an adventure through because the Because you don't want to write a story. And oh, to players, shh. You have my sincere thanks. What is he wearing? Everyone's wearing so much. Uh, he's just, he's wearing his jacket. <laughs> and this un, un iron shirt. He's a translator. He's just like, yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. I don't even need to be here. I'm about to, I'm about to play. <laughs> You need to dress nice for this place. These guys. Congratulations, Mr. Adoma. I am happy now to announce winners in a few more categories at the Game Awards. Here are the nominees Get out of the way, for Jeff. Best RPG: Baldur's Gate 3, Final Fantasy uh, 16. Why don't we just stop there? Uh, yeah, you already yeah. know what's Baldur's Gate. Final Fantasy. Baldur's Gate. Baldur's Gate. Watch Starfield take it. Goes to Baldur's Gate. Oh, yeah. Wow! What a uh, shock! It's a great game. You also play that good. It should win. It should win. Pikmin 4 is winning this. You think so? Oh, yeah. Sim strategy. Pikmin 4 is definitely no idea. Fire Emblem engage and Pikmin 4. The Pikmin 4 suck nuts that hard. Damn, that was good. Pikmin 4. Pikmin nuts is it sucking? My kid played the hell out of it. For best sports racing game. Wow, racing games are still a thing. I think I said this is probably about Forza. Forza. Yeah, I was gonna say Forza. 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 Turbo charge and the crew motor fast. This oh, year, the Game Award goes to Forza Motorsport. Congratulations, yeah. turn you know it. We saw it. The nominees for best multiplayer this year are Ooh. Baldur's Gate 3. See, this Street. one's, I don't know. Baldur's, Baldur's Gate. Gate. I hope Baldur's Street Fighter wins it. Baldur's, Baldur's Super Gate. Super Mario Brothers Wonder. Maybe Diablo. And the Game Baldur's Award Baldur's goes to Baldur's Gate Thank you. Game. A multiplayer game where four friends can play the game. I've never heard of it. Winning awards. Wow, maybe we should play it. <laughs> and the winner here is Genshin Impact. Yep. Cyberpunk 2077. Is Spider-Man going to win anything? No. Genshin wins Genshin this. Impact, Marvel's Spider-Man 2, and The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. And the Game Award goes to... Genshin. Baldur's oh, Gate yeah. oh. Baldur's Gate, it's baby! Genshin. Genshin fans! What happened? Because what happened, you know, what's Genshin happening? What's happening? There are a lot more women of oh, Baldur's Gate Samson. fans, Simmons. You are right. Thank you. You are 100% right. right. There's you a right. You are uh, right. You are right. Because the, Baldur's chicks? The silent majority mm -hmm. just took that, okay? He, he, he is actually not lying about Thank that. Thank you. He is not lying. Thank Baldur's you. Chicks. The silent majority of women gamers I everywhere. I agree Kenny 100%. Outnumbered the weebs. I'm sorry. Weebs are just a strong, a strong, loud voice. Are you trying to say there's more women than weebs? 
Yes. Then you're gonna get canceled. Oh well, you know, uh, come at me, bro. The weebs come are just, at me, bro. The weebs are just very loud online. What's happening? He's right. They're very loud online. But no, no, no. But beyond the whole whatever dynamics of it, Kenny's right. There are a lot of, there are a lot of, of uh, like, uh, women. A lot of girl, game, lot of girl gamers <laughs> love playing like D and D. Like D and D is 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 everyone. It really is. Well, what is D and D? I've never heard of it. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Something you, something, I don't like something this you trailer. wouldn't be interested yeah. in. Something you'd never like. I weird, do not bro. like this trailer. This trailer's yeah. fucking weird. <laughs> that was like immediately. Oh, here's the Elfell trailer. Okay, alright. Can you give us something else? Uh, it's gonna be Elfell. You know it was 2.5? Wow. That's, what Xbox, for, that's good, what Xbox does? Good for Strive. Good for Strive. Well, that was when you worked with Xbox. Yeah! Good for them. I just paid for their trailer oh. down there. Everyone, oh. everyone's telling me it's not Alpha. That was a, that was a lie. They, it's a lie. It's a lie. It's not true. It's not true. And here it is. That's Alpha. That looks like Lady. Damn, she's <gasps> like Alpha Valentine. She, is, she isn't like a J pop. No. She's like a scream lord. Yeah, she's she's. she's oh my wow. god. Yeah, she's ba uh, uh, baby metal. She's like baby metal scream lord shit. That's kind of sick. Well, this is a. What is happening? Good to you, Steve. Yeah. Did you like Elfell from XR? Yeah, but she was like a robot. Now <laughs> like, she is a robot. Yeah, what the heck is she? Oh, she's a gear. Yeah. So is, you know, most of the fucking Rock, characters. Death, metal, and love. Wow. Jesus. And it looks like what's his face? Nice. Oh God, that's almost out. All right, Max. Week of. Usape. Usape. Oh. Oh yeah, I heard about this. KOF mode. Wait, what? KOF mode. 3v3. That'd be kind of fun hard. online, right? It Wait, is six what? Player. It is six player online, 3v3. Yeah, not at the same time. No, it's the KOS yeah, style. Yeah. KOS style. You know what? I've been kind of hoping that they'd bring out the Destroyed. Like they're coming back, no, baby. Destroyed. <laughs> they're, still destroyed. they're still not bringing back Destroyed. Kenny, Kenny literally just like, just where I thought I was, I was out, they brought me back here. Dude, to play with the chat and get like six people? That is cool. Well, you could have done that with uh, Dragon, Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball, I know, but the net code, bro. Is this the Vin Diesel yeah, game? Yeah, get a PC. Oh, that goddamn Vin Diesel game. Yeah, the net code is not out yet. When, when the net the code arc, is good. Yeah. Yeah. Bam, they the beta. Vin Arc. Yeah. It's good. Vin, Vin Arc. That's going to be done. I don't, I don't know if that's what that is. Play now. Play now. Vin or Ark. Ark survival is Ark. Ark. Welcome back to the Game Awards. We still got some awards to hand out. Timothy Chalamet will be here to help. And we have some more world Lies premieres, including mm. this one. This one. PlayStation. Ooh. Oh, DLC. Oh, DLC for 14. Let's see how let's see what it looks like. I'm kind of curious. I'm curious if they announced the oh, 16, I mean. the, the PC version. Some sort of crystal. Enlightened souls forged great and terrible weapons called the Iconoclasts, from which icons derived them. Yeah, for the whole game. The whole uh, uh, characters for freaking Guilty Gear, not three. Uh, somebody's woke uh, this place up. Who's my third? The question is. Oh, hello? Man, I feel so weird about this game. Like, I love playing. But I kind of, I, I fell off. Weird that it, it takes, takes like fun. somewhere oh, in between oh, yeah, yeah, before yeah, the, the ending. Yeah. Wow, this, this is, is great. Eternal. Yeah. Welcome, my friends, to Mysidia. Hey, no funky uh, purple shit everywhere. Damn. Hey, there's Leviathan. There's Leviathan. Yeah, that was, that was teased, right? Where it was like, yeah, Leviathan is, is shown, but he's never there. Buy it today! Shadow dropped. For the first one. Oh, really? Not that long. And the second, the second expansion was like March-ish? Experience new no adventures PC before version. the final battle. Bro. It final said the thing on March 12th. With oh, of the God damn. That game needs a PC version. Five. There's a shadow drop for you. 
Now to present our See, next award, be best shot, game direction. Please welcome one of our industry's Damn, greatest best direction, and the next is uh, game of the year, right? Duty and global yeah. GM for Star Wars Jedi, Battlefield, Titanfall, and Apex Legends, Vince Zambella. Oh, Vince, yeah. Vince Zambella. Titanfall Legends. I am a beautiful American. The dynamic between some people, the way these people right. dress is some Good kind of crazy. Oh, we had a rebirth trailer. So, I, game I design we'll can be chaos. Actually, let me rephrase that. The best game design is almost always part chaos, right? Uh, today, oh, it's sorry. really normal for teams of hundreds to work for years on huge open worlds that are condensed into one package. When that chaos has somehow been harnessed into a cohesive artistic expression, that's great game design. That is true, Caramel But tonight, Jenkins. I'm proud to present the nominees like for the best game director. Dressed down are like the main See, this is where I thought they were going to split. Like, you know, like the owner was like Bill Gates. Yeah. yeah. So I was like, Colin like, Wake might up, win like, direction. Like, direction. Like, 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 dress and some of the others. This I actually like, don't know. I actually don't know what's taking this. Oh, uh, what's this one? Zelda, Spider-Man to Direction. It's mostly the same thing. Spider-Man. Spider-Man. Spider-Man's got this. Oh, Mario's a good chance because Mario kind of really changed it up with the The direction the in Spider-Man is crazy, bro. What's the direction? Uh, the entire story. I'm going Alan Wake 2 on this. Spider-Man. Spider-Man. I'm going to say Alan Wake 2. Mario or Baldur's Gate? Oh. Alan Wake 2. Yeah, damn. Wow. He was shook. And Simmons knows so much, and he's never even played the damn game. He never even touched the game. I know how it is. We just know how it's perceived. perceived. Yeah, yeah. Right? Perceived. So, in other words, Simmons are... knows it's bullshit. What people are... Simmons knows oh, Well, that perception isn't coming from that's not unfounded, right? Right, you obviously know it's fucking good. Like, it, just because we haven't played it doesn't mean it's like, you know, There's clearly... All of those games up here, these are, none of these are bad thank games. These yeah, are, yeah, yeah. These are all good But games. you know it's rigged. We want to thank... Like, there is a it's fucking huge rigged. level of rigged. Not specifically rigged. I wouldn't say rigged, it's just... The way they feel, the way they think. Yeah, which is rigged. How they feel, how they think, and it's also like, <laughs> they're not playing yes. all the games. Direction they're, they're going off of like Alan Wake and Browse Gates probably a game most of the media out which most of all of them play. And, and like one guy will play or two guys will play Spider Man. I like what he said, it's weighted. Joining us on well, people, all, it, it's not based on sales, dude. No, it's not on yeah, sales, but it should it, 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 it should be? Uh, you know. Really? No. No, no, no. I'm saying it should be uh, uh, based on uh, votes. It should be based on votes. It is. When votes of the, the, votes, the votes of the committee. Of, of people that have, like, experience uh, in the industry. Uh, Leading the same yeah, it's 90% of the votes. To be honest, if, 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 if it was... 10% is, is user votes. If it was votes, 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 shit. If it was right, votes guess who wins every single year, every single time? Uh, Everything. Fortnite. Today yeah. Could use Genshin. Genshin or Does that make sense? It's the gaming industry. Let the people decide. Uh, That's golden joysticks. Monday, December. People 11th, already did. Uh, it, guess what won? But then that would be like just the Bieber would have won every award, like the like, you know, uh, so yeah. you know? Then he deserves Thanks. it. It's the people. Let the people Thank choose. You. Thank you, Game Awards. They had a fan. They had a people vote. There's Baldur's Gate three here. There's golden joysticks is user voted. Baldur's Gate three there. Misty Man, thing. Like. At the end of the, the day, the, the people technically this year voted for Baldur's Gate. Please welcome grab, Gustav Tillaby, the creator of people by the nuts and didn't let go. The game. Oh, of course. Okay. <laughs> AF. The final. Fuck! You guys played, we played you all this. played this, right? So yeah, I really no. liked it. I, I love, it. love this game. This game, we set a bold vision for ourselves. We said that if we're going to make a shooter, it needs to be unique. It needs to be something that no one else is. I thought it was kind of cool, but the map was too Starting damn here big today, for, I'm for so the proud players and on grateful it. for the amazing team at Embark Studios who helped make this crazy dream a reality. And of course, to all of you, our amazing players, watching you play the finals it, was in the year. has Don't been the most that. gratifying See, you can't say you liked it. my entire okay. career. You hate it. You have say to say it. you hate it. Say you hated it. Yeah, but just play it. it. Okay. Never say anything good about it. Just <laughs> play it. <laughs> say just play it. It'll live forever. Have a great time when you're trade. playing it, but just and don't ever talk about it. Just say it's all right. At the very end. No, don't even acknowledge its existence, Bro. because that could get canceled too. Thank you, and enjoy. If you can say, I played the finals, it's already dead. Shut up and watch the trailer. <laughs> Ooh, new map? Damn. 
You guys never even gave this game a chance. I saw you play it. Yeah, that's that's not giving it a We're chance. for hours. Holy I saw shit. you seen you playing is me giving it that a chance. That is not giving it a chance. Oh, that right. is. Pick it up and play it. That's giving it a chance. It At hours. least Simmons actually played it. But you I, guys. I saw you play my, it. My opinion was I'll come back when, when it's finalized. Damn. In the yeah. finals? Well. In the finals. <laughs> More just like if they add more stuff. More... Yeah, this. I wanted. It's very very. I didn't like the two modes that much that they had. That's fine. Uh, I wanted to see it with like domination or hard point style. I wanted to see that. Like I didn't want to do this. Who knows what other modes? I mean, understand that this is gonna be. A, I mean, this is a budget game for sure. But I mean, it, from what they made so far, it is fantastic. So. It'll probably take a while before they add all the stuff you're talking yeah, about. My, my biggest thing was just kind of like, okay, I get what you're doing in the modes, but like, the spawn points sometimes mm. would be so far away. The spawn points wasn't even like the... the Because uh, uh, the map is so big. It wasn't was even like, the draw of the game. It's the destruction. Getting to like where the action was. Holy was like, fuck, look at that oh, weapon. Wow, downtown Las Vegas. Add, add more players. There is so much shit going on in this I game. I mean, I said right? that with like Call of Duty, you know that too, where it's like... I kind of just want like you know the, the the ground war. You know, I want the ten v ten or whatever. Yeah. I don't want I don't want this six v six thing. This game is like three v three v three. You're telling me it was hard to get back into the action. Yes. That's my only real issue with it. Because it was like three v three. Oh, play now. Play now. Oh, all right. That's Shit. Right. That's what I'm doing. Oh, so it was a beta when you play? Yeah. Xbox it's still. I mean, I, I don't even think that's full. Out now. PlayStation Five. After the show, make sure to check out the Game Awards in Fortnite as well. All month, fans have been voting for their favorite user-created island of the year, and the winner is Fort Who. Congratulations. Hey, that's, that's you. That's your yeah. persona, right? That's your persona? Is that Kenny's island? Kenny's so checked out. Look how checked out he is. Look how checked out he is. Island code is below. Still to come, the presentation of Game of the Year featuring our, our orchestral salute to the nominees. What Zelda is gonna be the trailer music that's not even in the game? Damn! Last last trailer opportunity. Nothing from Capcom yet. Yeah, we're waiting for the Street Fighter. No, I, I, don't, I don't think we're getting. I don't think you finished Game Awards with an Ed trailer. Oh no, he's coming. I don't think so. I thought he was being saved for Capcom or something. I was. I thought Akuma was being saved for Capcom. I don't know what the hell. This has been kind of tame. There's been, to be honest, the Sega announcement is awesome. Sega just wins so yeah. far. It was great. Now, Albeit, if Virtual Fighter was in there, it'd have been like pinnacle shit. If it was like all that stuff and BF, that'd have been right. like, oh my god, meltdown. But BF is more us rather than like the not everybody. The, the vast majority, because most people when they think about classic Sega, they think Golden Axe. So exactly, like, Golden yeah. Axe and you know Shinobi. Crazy Taxi. And, yep. That was Crazy Taxi. One was popular games on the Dreamcast. That's the thing, like, Crazy Taxi's a game that isn't even like, are you a Crazy Taxi fan? No. What the fuck? But do you know what Crazy Taxi is? Oh, hell yeah. Like, it's like a zeitgeist game. Like, it just has rooted its way to anybody that grew up around the 2000s or the 90s. You just know what Crazy Taxi is. Yeah. I, I'm ignoring Rebirth, okay? I'm ignoring it. Because I am, I'm ignoring it. I'm ignoring for Rebirth. I'm sorry, shut up, chat. I'm gonna wait to get some, uh, to get some compendium at the end if I should even watch this extended Rebirth trailer. Everyone's saying really don't watch it. it shows a lot. That's what I read. Oh, God damn it. All night you've been voting on Twitch for which mobile that's so game shitty. you're hyped for in 2020. I, I guess that's close to After our launch show, trailer. Should I watch it show in the room Twitch and then I tell Google you? Google Play will reveal the winner <laughs> of its Play More. Maybe. Board. Awesome. Thanks, Sydney. Well, now it's time for tonight's final world premiere. That's right. We're getting towards the end of the show. And this one, I will let speak for itself. They're gone. Oh, fuck you. Ooh, oh, fuck you. It's not oh, familiar. fuck you, dude. It's over. Yeah. Oh, fuck you, oh. dude. Right and burnt. Yep, here we go. Oh, yeah. Why are you being chased by several of those things? Look at the sword. New Monster Hunter chat, let's do it. 
Wow. Navigating herds and stuff. You're oh, running away them and, oh. from an avalanche. Oh, no. He's riding that, that bird dog thing from episode three. Oh, my God, dude. What the hell? And it flies. Whoa. This looks very ambitious, Capcom. Whoa, with Terraform. Let's go! Let's go! Wild! Wild! Let's go! Actual next gen. Oh, what? Monster World? Yeah. What the fuck? There we go. What the hell? New Monster Hunter. Yo! I missed it? Oh! Ah, that's not next year! Five Xbox team. Yeah. Please welcome Thank God. to the stage. I missed Monster it. Hunter series producer Ryozo Tujimoto. Oh I'm God so damn! I don't even know if I want to clap now. It's <laughs> 2025. So far away. Steam. You showed me the gameplay. You gave me a demo of the game, and wow! I gotta tell you guys, it looks. Oh, incredible. he got to play it. Everyone wants to know. We saw 2025. Uh, when do we get to play this? Hi, uh, next week. Uh, え、こちらですね。え、9月に Ah, uh, no new info. I think everyone wants we just to miss Monster Hunter Wild. Oh my god. Any sense oh. of what we're going to see around this game? はい、え、こちらの we plan on revealing more information about this game in uh, the summer of 2024. Okay. So we hope you keep it. We're going to be playing it at Jeff's also, event. Also, Capcom is currently next celebrating year. its oh, four-year yeah. anniversary. I would like to thank oh. all of the Capcom fans 100%. for all of your love and support throughout all these years. It's the literal. Yeah, he specifically says we'll talk about it next. Capcom will continue yeah. to create. Hmm. It's it's the literal follow-up to Capcom's. Biggest uh, game ever. Yep, 100%. Summer Game Fest? Summer Game Fest. Thank you, Great to see you. All right. Well, now to present Game of the Year from the upcoming films. That's pretty big. That's Hunt pretty big. It looks kind of crazy, too. Like, I mean, the environment wasn't that great. It was like a desert. Yeah, yeah well, it did this terraform. But then it terraformed. All right. Good morning. Um, oh, I think it'll actually be Baldur's Gate 3. I'm leaning at this point. Baldur's Gate 3. Passion and technical brilliance. Of Willy Wonka. I'm gonna say Baldur's Gate three, so I can be right for once. Inspiring. Play Spider Man. Spider Man's in here. Yeah. Each of these Spider Man is actually in here. Again, Lauren Balfe and the Game Awards Orchestra. But they gave Baldur's Gate a couple of cookies. I. Uh, mm. What do you think, Simmons? Simmons does do you know. Think, do you think it's still a risk that Zelda could take it, or do you think it's confirmed Baldur's Gate three at this point, after what's already won? Simmons is only one, one big I thing. I think it's close, but I think it's leaning into Baldur's Gate. It's leaning into Baldur's Gate because it feels like it's starting to sweep a little bit, but Zelda's only won one thing. Zelda, Action Adventure. Zelda didn't even deserve that one thing. God damn. Uh, God damn. Where's Fluke guys? Zelda deserved an engineering award. They promised Fluke There's an award for like... You go to, you're, saying, you're saying just Monolith Soft deserves that award? <laughs> Dude, Spider-Man... There it is! Spider-Man didn't win shit Thank today. you! I would say it's just got nominated for for, for, e for excellence in like engineering and like like optimization. I would say Zelda would deserve it for for the physics engine and stuff they did, which was insane on a potato. Yeah, I would absolutely say that. But like as far as anything else, and I played a lot of games this year. But so how is the media gonna go? I think three, and I think it's closer to that and Alan Wake two than than it might be. But who's going to win Best Flute Performance in the Game Awards? The Flute Man, right there! <laughs> Mr. The McFlute Man! Mr. McFlute Man? 
Like it sooner, thank you. <laughs> Damn, dude. <laughs> Monster Hunter <laughs> is next, next year, bro. That shit is that shit is in GTA 6 territory. Next, yeah. next year. But at least it's coming out on PC first. It's going to be crossplay, which is going to be great. 100%. Damn, it's going off. There's no way it's not. <laughs> this was my early personal goatee. What? Resident Evil 4. Oh, yeah. It was really good. It's weird. fucking really good. Yeah, it's weird how it kind of almost got like swallowed up. Oh, like party four. It didn't win any awards either, huh? Nope. Didn't win anything. Damn. I got nominated for like two things. This one would be shocking as shit if it took it. Like this one would be like, what the hell? If this one's game of the year? Dude, yeah. Because it's, it's a won't. remake and then. Exactly. It, it, exactly. They don't like remakes. They don't like. Um, they not. They don't let it. It's just that it's. it's no, so they don't. Close. They don't like remakes and they don't like comic books. Really you have a different crew every time, Chad. And you know what's funny? That Pedro, he makes a lot of his own instruments. Okay, he just dropped a flute, just grabbing another one. Damn, he grabbed a big ass flute. Like, fuck it. Up there. King flute. Look Upgrade. at him. Upgrade. Did you see the way he threw that down? Look at this thing. Holy oh, hell. He needs to get a bigger one. Yeah. <laughs> I actually thought some of the music experiment too is really good. Yeah. Actually. There, there was a. God damn, bro! He threw that flute down. And the last, the last quarter of Spider-Man Two is fucking awesome. You should have picked up that flute for life. It's just that it takes a while to grow up to it, right? It takes like fifty percent of the game for you to like really get to that point. I enjoyed a lot of the stuff in between, but I did a lot of the side missions too. You know, it just didn't grab me. Yeah, I did a ton of side shit. Grabbing another one, and I did it again for Miles Morales. But then this one was like, I feel like I'm playing the same game again. Sacks the phone back. Flute of my phone. Flute king. You played it back to back. No, no, well, I mean, I've played all of them, right? Right, right. So I just felt like when we were playing Spider-Man 2, the first 50% of the game, I feel like I'm playing the same game again. You know? Oh, Until, game. like, obviously shit goes down, and it's like, whoa, this is great. Yeah. The next game awards, he's going to play three flutes at the same time. <laughs> With his foot. All right. Baldur's Gate's my choice. And the game of the year my is... I said it first, Zelda. Baldur's Gate. Yeah, I heard that game. I heard that game. There it is. Oh, right in there. I called it. 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 for a reason. I knew it. He knew it. Good shit. I knew it and he knew it. Look at that. I am good. I am happy to be wrong. There it is. I'm happy to be wrong. I knew it all along. It's the game of the year. You guys should try it out. I knew Good. it all along. With me. <laughs> Seriously, I knew yep. it all along. Yep. That's actually great. Never playing this game. Never Good. playing this game. Good. But it needed to win. Uh -huh. It needed to. Uh -huh. Explain why, that kicks, because because th this was um, this okay thank you. because the thank sequel you so to the one of the um, most highly critically acclaimed games like of Ball's all Gate time was this year, and it didn't win. It won to the, it lost to this. It lost to this one, yeah. Which and was, how uh, this game was made? How it was made? How it was different story development? How everything went down? Sort of this this is, is what that's what. That's why it's um, important. This needs to be the way, industry standard. You, th you think also, Nintendo's fuming right now? Yes. No. Uh, they're fuming. <laughs> they're <just> losing <laughs> it. Yuma is on a plane already. Right? Right? He's, He's coming over. He's, He's out of there. Right? there. Reggie tried to uh, stop him. Fuck this place. And he kicked over your, like yeah, fucking dude, stuff on the way out. Good shit. Kicked over shit all the way out. You should be crying shit. This means the industry is like healing. Like since COVID and shit like that shit is healing. No, now with the 7,000 layoffs that happened. That shit is not healing. This shit is not healing. Something a good thing happened tonight, but outside of that, there's no healing. Just pain. There's still fun. Good shit, Baldur's Game. I'm just good. It beat you deserve Zelda. It. Real, like good. Zelda and Game Awards, just like oh, there's a Zelda and Game Awards. Zelda it wins. wins. Yeah, it by wins. default. And then this shit. By happens. default. I swear, somebody told that guy, yeah, you're gonna win everything in that. He was like, I'm coming in with a fucking uh, uh, night suit. I know we'll see it. You next year at our 10th anniversary Game Awards, which I'm happy to announce, we'll return right here to the Peacock Theater on but Thursday. But it'll be named December. something else. It was a very good show, right? It was consistent. Happy it flowed. Holidays. There was always something yeah, like. As far I, as like show presentation, yes, it was. It, good. It's great. Done well. Not no a lot interrupted. The goons are still there. Not a lot of crazy yeah. trailers. Two things came true for us tonight. That was on a gift sub bet, and that was just a, a new Monster Hunter and a rebirth trailer. That was it. <laughs>